I'm going to check if we have audio we issues. Oh. We don't have audio issues this time. I did remember. That's okay. awesome. Okay. The classic kid spin. Oh, I accidentally chose the wrong set. Wow, what an idiot. What? I can't believe it. The Calafi's there. <laughs> oh, fuck my butt. Why did it... Why? How do I unspin him? I did it. <laughs> oh, God. Oh, my guy, death pose. Damn it. Okay, <laughs> hold on. I need to do some hot fixes. Gerard. I mean, I'm not Gerard. Why? Why would you think that? Okay. Way bashing. God, this is <laughs> so annoying. Dashing. Hold on, I've got to delay things by a second because I. Guys, I'm guys, I'm wave dashing. You're not wave dashing. Shut up. I am. Look, You're dash dancing, bro. Just my bit. He will never be wave dashing. <laughs> oh my god, he's wave dashing. <laughs> He will never be Chester Cheddarman. Oh my god. Actually, now he it's... is. <laughs> yeah, now he is. Now that's me because I keep switching to Gerard. I, I he will never, never be Earl. Cheddarman. He will never be Earl. Oh my god. He becomes Earl. It's Earl. I don't know why my mic's. Okay, this is. Is it being uh, a moment? Yeah, sorry. I fucked something up. Uh, uh, live and learn. Uh, if you copy that a preset on Streamlabs, and then uh, you change that preset, the other preset will also just change, just because. Mm. That's lesson learned. Moment. I think this should be... Justin, talk. Hello? It's Kano, can't yeah. believe it. Yeah, I figured. Hello? Is anyone hello, there? Hello. Okay. Hello. 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 I love Scott Cawthorn. <laughs> Scott I Cawthorn Scott is Cawthorn. pretty awesome. In my humble opinion. All right, hold on. I've got, I've got the rhythm now. This shouldn't take much longer. Whoa. What the fuck? That's so much Pepsi. That's so much pilk. I'm so no, full I'm from still... pilk. I'm so full from Pilk. Okay, canonically, Earl is drinking Pilk in the Feywild. Fey He's drinking Pilk in the Feywild? Yes, canonically. Oh, God. Except it's not Pepsi milk, it's pea milk, because Pepsi doesn't exist yet. No, it's pickle milk. Well, no, that's... no. That's arguably Water. worse than either of the <laughs> options presented. <laughs> yeah, I agree. Exactly, <laughs> exactly. <laughs> oh, God, kid's gone. He's Goodbye. so... Kid goes into orbit. What the Kids don't fucking be damn man. This sucks. Is it being? Is it being a moment? No, I, I got it. Like if you look at the stream, it's like gradually fixing itself. It's just irritating. Do you guys like guys? We should all just like fucking. Yeah, we should revolt. No. Fuck I, Andrew. Okay. We should revolt. Yeah, where are the dungeon masters? Yeah. Oh please! I, will, I have several characters ready. People's union. <laughs> Look, we'll all be the DM for one play. I just, I just want to do something that will like derail Andrew's entire like thing. Like, I just like, what if we all just start fucking like destroying the boat we're on right now? Yeah, I mean, you I'm pretty could, sure we die. You could definitely easily derail what I have planned because it's not, it's not like, you know, it's not hard to derail a campaign. You yeah, just have to. Right. Yeah. You just, like, have to take a look at, like, my map and be like, I want to travel to the Devil's Peak. And then all of a sudden, like, it's a different campaign now. Like, I don't know what to say. I, I take a look at the map and I'm like, I want to go backwards. I want to go to the other. I, I want to go home. I want a backwards, <laughs> backwards long <laughs> time. Did, did I ever give you guys the map of Kalidori? No. no. Okay, you guys probably need that. Here you go. I really well, like the I want to go home. <laughs> I wish for mother's company. I'm a little homesick. There you go. If you guys look... <laughs> The I entire... invite everyone to a uh, team party at my home. Okay, so where are we on the... Okay, like, you guys... The... On the water, idiot. Okay, so you see the Kingdom of Chaldea at the top? Yeah, yeah. You're about to approach that top of the lip at the Freedmen's Gather. All right, all right. And where did we come from? Me, uh, you came from the Kingdom thing. of Chaldea. The dock there. Uh, the okay. dock there. My bad. 
Uh, there. Uh, where's the Where'd king? Oh, I see. Yeah. Well, wow, that doesn't look that big. Um, it doesn't look that big, but the water it space is. in between Chaldea and Friedman's Gather is a day of travel. Oh, interesting. Uh, the thing about this world is, as that's it's less... new. Oh, sorry. Uh, I was gonna. That's less than you thought. No, I was gonna say that's less than like from I don't know, fucking North Carolina to Puerto Rico. So that's that's a pretty good gap. I have, I'm from there. North Puerto Carolina Rico? or Puerto Rico? North Carolina. Yeah. Well, it's funny because I'm from Puerto Justin's Rico. from Puerto Rico, guys. <laughs> <laughs> well, we have so much in common. It'd be funny if Justin was from Puerto Rico, but... Um, yeah. Uh, that would feel very threatening. Also, something to understand is that as this uh, continent is mostly new, the world is only like 700 years old, it's a lot of forest. Like, it's a lot of forest that hasn't been I mean, capitalized on yet. What if what if I instead of doing this campaign? What I if I actually... manifest destiny? Yeah, that's pretty yeah. much what I was gonna say. Like, what if, I just, I what, what if we just start fucking like taking the land for ourselves and you, you guys and, like build an empire, make our you own guys, kingdom? Okay, that'd you be guys, fucking awesome. Yeah. You guys are a uh, series. Maybe not for the native. <laughs> but no, you guys are in a series of what are going to be four basically like kind of prequel campaigns before I start like doing. A bunch of campaigns again um mm -hmm. so i mean you guys are I, I just think it would if you were going to do that i would be very interested in seeing it happen that's all I'm i gonna wanna say. I, I really <laughs> do want to now well, dude well, you're telling me we have this whole continent basically to like take over with like look i'm just gonna say this we should wait for our world conquering plans for a bit later because we are still level one. Yeah, I no. want to damn people. If you guys Let's really now, if you guys really <laughs> wanted to, this like your your ship group could probably take you all down at the moment. <laughs> so we're going to the grand line already, not boys. I'm <laughs> mortal. You guys are not going to the grand line. But there, <laughs> if you really once again, if you really wanted to, this is not a pirate campaign. But there is. Um, something like the Grand Line called the Exodus Gate, um, which is uh, basically sort of like this entrance to essentially a big sailing dimension that right, is guys, uninhabited by Leviathan. Oh, oh, guys, you see that, that, that like big island type Get thing the straw in the hat. left corner? Yeah. Canonically, one of us has to buy a straw hat at one point <laughs> before we start anything. Though I will say... <laughs> It would be a lot of trouble if you decided to derail the campaign right now, because one, you guys would probably get fucking killed, and two, uh, like I don't have anything prepared for if you do. Don't, that. don't right, worry yeah. about that. We're not going to do that yet. Uh, I yeah. hope. I, uh, uh, it doesn't. I would never. I've I've seen some serious campaign derails. Who's um, going to be the Nami of the group? <laughs> the woman. <laughs> Me. Wait, uh, so if we do this though, you guys see that like uh, little, uh, the island thing in the bottom left corner of the map? I say we do that one because it looks like it would have the least amount of resistance. I say I maybe the place map. under Rosemary. Oh, like, wait, I see what you're talking see about. See that though. like little peninsula land there? Yeah, I think that could I mean, be easy taken. If you guys really wanted to, there are also just uninhabited areas. Like, uh, I mean, the, the, forest, the forest between Shredan and Escan, the Devil's That's Peak. Not as fun. The Devil's Peak doesn't have, like, any foreseeable life on it at the moment, uh, as well as Hell's Hallway. There aren't people there. They're just travel areas, which is why they have notorious Bro, names. Guys, look at how big the Devil's Peak is. Come on. You're telling we could definitely take that. one segment of the Devil's Peak because that we would be... We could take, like, um, one of the horns of it. Okay, so, we should probably start soon. We should probably start. So, yeah, something, I like that idea. Something important to understand about the Devil's Peak is that there are rumors of horrific beasts in the forests, which is why none have attempted to colonize. Uh, well, that's, natives. That's yeah, doing. rumors. Rumors. We don't know if they, they exist. They are We're going to go find out. Bro. Okay. Um, I like this idea, guys. All right. Well, you know, I'm glad. I'm, I'm <laughs> glad you guys are happy. Um, <laughs> but let us officially begin the session. Um, and let me grab... The music. I, think, I also think that like wooded area between the the one that Andrew mentioned. I like that one. It looks trade and Eskan. Yeah, it would be good for trade. I will say that. That's what I if was we, thinking. We can make we can monopolize. Um, that. 
Yeah. yeah, it'd be good for trade, not for war. If we do need oh to go God, to war, them. but the the thing is, it's like if 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 places go to war, they we'd be a very essential part of that. Yeah, you'd also be right in the middle of the war if those two nations just happened to go to war. So, oh, I can we can do war hunt. God, Which, um, damn, so we're... either they would negotiate with us, or they would absolutely like just invade. Yeah, for the record, Traydan and Escan are on the border of a war currently because Escan is mostly uh, skinwalkers, which are like animal people, and Traydan mm -hmm. are sort of uh, it's it's a dictatorship nation. Uh, of I would like you to take one. I would like you to look at our party real quick. I'm I'm you look at our party real quick. I'm looking. And uh, what what side do you think we would go with? Huh? Um, look at our party. I feel like if a war broke out, I think we know. Like, I think it just. I, me... I think. But also, what about that. what about trade and in, in between the like uh fucking the the Friedman's? Yeah. Okay, so are you asking about uh where the Friedman's Bureau lands in trade? In like the world of trade, like how the Freedmen's Bureau, yeah, or Freedmen's Gather. Apologies, I'm like, <laughs> I, forgot you... what... <laughs> I forgot the you... name of my own thing. Do you know what the Freedmen's Bureau is, Andrew? <laughs> nope. <laughs> <laughs> it, it's like a Teddy Roosevelt thing, right? No. <laughs> I don't know. Why the fuck would I know? Andrew, Andrew, the Freedmen's Bureau. like Bureau. <laughs> No, the the Freedmen's Bureau was like a war agency in 1865 to like that's assist a... formerly enslaved people or something like that's that. That's awesome. Okay. Yeah. Um, but yes, the Freedmen's Gather is the uh, biggest <laughs> hub of trade in the entire continent. Um, and for, for good it's, reason. For it, good it's reason. literally run by the four wealthiest uh, members of. The yeah, we're taking that country. one. Oh, they're in no, uber wait, capitalism mode. Jeff Bezos. He's, what about he the woods there. in between trade and that? Bezos is a group. Let's go. Uh, Sparrow's Pinch. Is that what that says? I can't read that. Yeah. Sparrow's Pinch. We're gonna yeah. fuck that shit up. I think we should go after Sparrow's Pinch. I think that's yeah, very yeah, good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I feel like that. I mean, that, we, it's we, Friedman's gathering. Okay. Okay. Well, this is this is discussion for a later date. <laughs> Let's let's get started. We we got the oh, this this guy thinks he's the the head of our group. You hear that? He's trying no. to delay our plans. <laughs> you know what? I exactly, think we're going to die. That's what I'm saying oh, we are listen, going buddy, to die. If you don't want to be a part of the revolution, you can leave. <laughs> we don't need you. Moment. <laughs> Anyways. Yeah, like, I would like to get actually started. <laughs> yeah. All right. Um. So, uh, you travel the rest of the day after the storm subsides, and you reach the Freedmen's Gather. Also, I just want to say, that music kicked in at a perfect moment. So, this is the Freedmen's Gather. It's obviously not a full active map, um, but just to guide you guys around what's going on here... Let me pull up my notes briefly. What the fuck? What is it? What? what There's a what fucking do I... coliseum in the middle. Let's go fight some. <laughs> okay, yes. Um, there is also a slight war culture. I mean, they believe in monetization oh. of anything. So the monetization of combat is, is not a, you know, a far stretch. Why do I feel like I'm in a flash game right now? <laughs> <laughs> Earl and Ray are gonna have a fun time. Yo, we play in Toontown. Yeah, Earl and like <laughs> real life Ray are gonna have an amazing time. <laughs> yeah, Earl and Ray Muller. All right. Um. So, uh, just to kind of uh, uh caramelize what you're seeing. So this here, this big area of houses, okay. is the main housing district. Um. And, and by the way, this is split into four quadrants. Uh, if you see it kind of branches off and then the Coliseum is the middle um so there's the four housing quadrants and then uh the four shopping districts uh one in each quadrant um there is a complete overhaul of shops it looks like there is almost a shop for each person that lives in the city um there are like 150 probably and then like you know some people have wives and shit 
you know. And then Bad. in each of the corners are the noble houses. Um, the blue one belongs to uh, the McCornicks. The um, purple belongs to the Crast. Uh, the green to Maverick. And the red to Skoro, the four leaders of the nation. Uh, mm. So. It's just like Avatar. Yeah. Mm. Um, as you sort of. Uh, oh, yo, that's me. As you sort of. No, off, that's me. That's me. Yo, that's me. As you sort of offboard the ship, um, the captain will look at you <laughs> and say, Hey, as we're getting these wine. <laughs> I hate you. <laughs> um. <laughs> I as we try to sell these. Why do wines, we have to like control? That's awful. <laughs> I as we try to sell these wines, uh, you all should try to find some business yourself. Captain, why are we moving around all the time? Sorry, we don't name man. I'll get to it. I can't stop. <laughs> and you all are free to sort of invest yourself anywhere, but the main idea is that you guys would sort of, um, if you want to, of course, the main idea the captain's getting at, uh, uh, come on. <laughs> I'm trying to push it back down. <laughs> Look how disappointed you sound. This is like a kindergarten class. <laughs> the, the main idea the captain was getting at is to go through the city, visit shops you like, and try to make money. And also, one last thing I forgot to mention, um, he will say, and just to be nice, I'll give you all half your uh, payment since we've gotten half of the way there. And you all gain 50 gold. Thank you. Uh, yeah. Captain, Thank you, Captain. Which I am now adding to your guys' inventories. Wow. All right. I'm going to scam Money. someone. Time to scam. Let's go. Oh, <laughs> the currency. Just got so much health. We're big now. Also, uh, just just to Hello, let it guys. be known, we died. <laughs> no, no. What, what are you guys doing, man? <laughs> I don't know what they're doing. <laughs> Anyways, try, try um, it now. Try it now, losers. Try it now. <laughs> All right. So, <laughs> where, do, where do we? Uh, where um, do we want to go first, all of you? <laughs> Jesus Christ. This is a fucking um, kindergarten class, dude. Where, where do we want to head off first, everybody? Let's find the most fertile person here. Scam them, of course. Is that all you think about, you two? <laughs> yes. Yes! Oh, not no. really one for scamming. <laughs> yes. <laughs> You guys are. You guys must be real hits at parties. <laughs> Only for the one Absolutely. time. <laughs> uh, I really want to see what that giant fucking coliseum is about. We shall head over there first, I guess. I am. I'm okay with that. I, fuck. <laughs> I was just like choked on my spin. I, I knew that somehow you guys would make your way into the giant coliseum, but like... Obviously. <laughs> you need to so go there. There's, Legally. There's not exactly a map prepared for it, um, but a uh, guard will greet you at the entrance and say, One gold for each of you if you want to watch. Wait, hold on. So if we, say, if we pay money, we're not going to see anything because there's not really a map? Is that what you're saying? I mean, your characters will see something, but the, oh. like I, I, I don't know. I have tokens I can pull up and like show them fighting. I, I figured it would be boring to watch anyway because it would literally just be like me rolling dice back and forth. Like I'll describe <laughs> it if you. I, I will describe well, it for you guys. But you guys want to go enter? Can we fight? Um, uh, you can fight. You can enter if. Oh you shit! Have to I, I want to fight in the Coliseum. This I know what awesome. I'm doing. Um, I guess. <laughs> yes, sir. So you guys would like to fight in the Coliseum? Yeah. What if we all get like pitted against each other and we like <laughs> that, that, would like, be, <laughs> that would be that would be worse. Only one of us gets to leave. Would um, this be small? Uh, wait. How, are you he asking might. how big it is? Hmm. 
What'd you ask? Uh, I I was going to say something, but I stopped myself from saying it. Because, yeah. Uh, what Anyways. do you mean, because, yeah? Kind of because I didn't think it all the way through. Uh, I no longer wanted to say what I was going to say. I just I didn't misspelled say Colosseum. It. It's fine. Moment. It Colosseum. Colosseum. <laughs> Um, should we get more geared up before we go to the Colosseum, though? Won't they take it away? Will they? Yeah, don't they give us stuff? That's how Colosseums work. Ah, uh, yes, they will give you swords and shit and armor. Um, whether you guys are proficient with those swords or armor, that is very that, questionable. Honestly, that sounds like a great time. Hmm. Um... Fuzz, Not you're telling me you don't, you don't, <coughs> you don't want to fight in this thing? Look how big this thing is. I fear I'm going to never a fighter also, myself. Also, understand oh. that if you do not, uh, as they say, raise the white flag, you have risk of death. <laughs> I feel like that's obvious, but, you know, I'm yeah. saying it anyway. How do, wait, how do, how, okay. What, what do you mean, how? I was gonna say, how do I explicitly surrender? But I realized you go, I probably would just scream. You go, I <laughs> surrender, I surrender. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> okay, let me it's make sure. Go, go. Andrew, is there a way to for me to like check my inventory? Um. Yes. Yeah, you <laughs> look on. in your inventory. Okay, no, but like, uh, uh, we're you, all you, a collective. Look, you go to actors and you click on your character and then go to inventory. Okay. It's uh, the yeah. third icon. Third icon. There we go. There we go. I got it. Good. You fucking better get it, loser. I'm sorry. Fuck you. All right. Um. So I just did some on-the-fly prep. Welcome to the. Oh fuck. <laughs> Big. Uh, this happens. Welcome. The night? Welcome to the Coliseum, guys. Um. So as you enter. You realize it is sort of this hulking, um, 300 wow. foot long structure. Damn. Uh, which you did Dude. not quite expect it to be so big, like from the outside looking in. But as you sort of uh, look to the battle hall, you realize it is rather huge. Do you guys think we'll see any big, burly, sweaty, bulky men in here? God, I hope I mean, so. I mean, <laughs> so, of you guys, who decided to enter? Uh, I'm definitely going in. Oh yeah, Earl, me too. Earl, Earl did not. I'm gonna watch and try to s scam some people with betting. Can I? Are we I, actually I, fighting though? Oh can shit! I sneak my cards in. Can I? Try yeah, I was gonna ask arc. if I could like make a sleight of hand check to like sneak my like ball bearings in. Oh okay. Um yeah, you guys make sleight of hand to sneak. Oh your boy. Shit in. Oh, <laughs> so Chester, you are caught immediately and uh, asked to forfeit your item, and uh, the guard kind of looks at you and goes, hey, buddy, this happens again. You're not going to be allowed to compete. I'll do it again. I'm sorry, but like, I, they, I need these. They're not for They're not magic or anything. I just... I get scared. All right, without... kid, the same thing happens to you. He sees <laughs> sort of this, like, bulge in your pocket, and it's like, hey, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> I need those too, and he'll point to your pocket. Are and you excited to see me or something? About? There's nothing in there. He will literally like grab your arm and reach into your pocket and pull out the bag of ball bearings. Um, as he can clearly <laughs> see them. Uh, <laughs> really and calm, bro. He will sort of like yeah. shove your back into the Coliseum. Um, I can't, where I you, think we got. Oh, sorry. Where you will see. Just, uh, give me a second. Luckily. Are you fucking joking, man? No. You guys will see. Um, just, uh, a group. I hope we can fight a lion. A group of, uh, different people. Kid, I think we're a little in over our heads. What do you think? Nah, we got this. We got this. That's what I'm saying. You know, I never doubted us for a second. <laughs> All right. Ignore how they all look the same. It's not like factions or anything. These are just 
you know, Blast. related. Are there bets <laughs> going on right now? I sure uh, hope yes. our, I sure hope our friends are betting for there us. Are there are. Yeah, we we're gonna win currently. Yeah, it would be funny. It would be absolutely moronic of them if they didn't. Go to the betting center and put twenty gold on them. <coughs> on each of them? Yes. <laughs> All right. Um, you will see that they have rather low odds. Um, as the newcomers, <clears throat> they. You know, Chester especially looks quite weak. Um, <laughs> so, not a lot of people betting I on him. flex to the crowd. Uh, they, <laughs> they, they they kind of just stare in silence. They're not paying attention to you. Um, can, I, can I start running in circles and see, like, if they have a response? I want them to, I want them to be like, woo! And if they lose, I'm just going to... Trying to deceive the guy and say, hey, look, that's, that's okay. my money. The Someone response you from get me. from the crowd might be different than you think as they begin laughing. Yeah, um, you see that? They're cheering for us, kid. I like to imagine when your guy, like, your token goes inside mine, you're like the, going between my legs. <laughs> <laughs> that is a funny that? thought. They're, they're cheering for us. Doesn't that it boost your morale? We've got this. We they should love do. us. They love us. <laughs> All right, so, um, as, uh, as the crowd, uh, sees sort of this, uh, figure begin walking to the screen, talk, walking, uh, to the stand, um, please make history checks. Oh boy, I sure do know a lot about history. I'm a genius. Wait, In do you want 20s. us all to make history, or just those two? Uh, actually, all of you can make history, because you're all... You know, here. Oh shit, where's Wait. my history? It's in your oh, abilities. Uh, let me what the sure. fuck's my history, bro? Where here it is. Here. It's, it's above insight. It's above insight. Man, my insight. Oh, no. I, well, I, Man. Told you, I told you I knew the most about history here. Alright, so who passes? My dad taught me quite oh. a bit. Uh, none of you know what's going on. Fuck. Uh, man, none of you know this man, but it's a man with a silver mustache and what seems to be sort of red robes. Um, and he will come out and say, uh, simply, Is everybody ready? And the crowd will cheer and go, Yeah! Yeah! yeah. Kid, do you see that guy up there? Dude, he's fucking Jack, dude. What the fuck are we gonna do? I don't think we're gonna fight him. I, I mean... Oh, that dude, oh. No, I mean the Sorry, one- Sorry, like... I, I was gazing at someone else. He's you looking at me again, or... buddy, come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He was longingly gazing into your <laughs> eyes. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, hold on. I'm just now realizing you can't see some of their health bars. What are we fighting with? Okay, hold on. Once? Um, moment, baby. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we get, like, actual Glocks. The fucking AK. <laughs> I'm having to do stuff. I mean, I, it's just like, you know. So, um, you guys get to choose sort of a weapon. You guys can choose between a mace, a, a, a scimitar, and a crossbow. Uh, I'm do gonna we? Go with, uh, uh, I'm gonna go with the crossbow. Do we both get crossbows, or can is it like? Do you get to choose one weapon. Um, and is 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 the crossbow taken now? Can I not get the crossbow? Now? <laughs> no, it's it's not like that now. Fuck. Okay. 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 Yeah, I'll take the crossbow too. <laughs> I just realized Let's I go. only have eight health. <laughs> I have nine. <laughs> okay, hold on. I need to redo this because I oversighted a couple of things. Um, yeah, how little I'm, health I'm sorry. we have. No, no, no. I don't care about how much health you have. You chose this. Um, Wait a no. second. Is Earl the most healthy out of everybody here? I collapse here? on the floor. Yes, you God. are, actually. <laughs> you play dead. Um, <laughs> what the? I can't believe it. This Give me check me. your DMs. Oh, yeah. yeah I yeah. pass out from heat exhaustion. It's, there's, I'm sweating so much. 
please. Why are you sweating so much? <laughs> Scared. Too hot. All right. Uh, you guys should be able to see. I think their my computer HP just shit now. itself. Did it actually? I have no. I I'm. No, I have no clue what's going on. Oh, oh, we're back. Okay, that's good. Um, all right. So, you see a large crowd of fighters ahead of you, and Chester, you chose the crossbow, um, crossbow which you actually don't have, so I need to give that to you. What do we get if we win? Uh, gold. Oh. We know how much. Um, you didn't ask the guy. He just assumed you knew. Considering <laughs> you were signing up to a death match. Um... Normal things. So he, do that, you know. he maybe figured that, um, you know, yeah. Uh, also, you still do have your bite available to you because it's just, you know, oh, shit. it's just something you can do and your unarmed yeah. strike if you're someone with better unarmed strike. I didn't expect them to rip my teeth out. So. Um, kid, are you assuming a scimitar? Uh, I was gonna take the crossbow as well because I have my little bite move that I can use, right? Uh, I might have forgotten forgotten to give it to you, but you should, yeah. Is it just a D four? Uh, I thought it was, yeah. I think I thought it was just two D four or something like that. Yeah, two D four seems a bit much. Can you check? Here, let me pull it up. Yeah. Like crossbow. <laughs> Um, also, uh, one good thing, you do get to keep the weapons afterwards, if that even interests you. Even if we you. lose? Even if you lose, as long as you're not dead. Yeah, I figured that Still part. Does. Also, uh, you did also have to unequip your armor, so... That's... Oh no. That's another thing to keep mind of. I mean, you don't even have armor, so it didn't matter much yeah. for you. And it only lowered... Uh, kids AC by one, so. No. Are, you, are you dead, man? Why'd you die? <laughs> Can't believe it. Died. Death of fear. <laughs> Chester just shat himself to death. Chester, <laughs> Chester passes out. Hold on. Oh. He all disappeared from, from this depression. They saw a rat man die. Like, well, I can't live with him anymore. And he died. <laughs> Well, wow. dice. One crit, one crit fail. I'm just gonna make this easier. Like I, I... <laughs> bandit rolls nat twenty. <laughs> Get this guy out he of here. die. <laughs> that, by the they way, these guys aren't. Here. Yeah, these guys aren't all against you. For the record. They're fighting each oh. other too. Oh, that makes yeah, sense. Yeah, you can just yeah, wait yeah, them out. Yeah. This is this is basically a big battle royale. You guys are against can... each other too. Yo, I love for the record. Let's go. Let me wake up. Uh, how? Oh, uh, so I, you I took a nap. You guys, ah! you guys are informed to start sort of in the center with all the action. Hey, kid. Number one victory royale. Yeah, yeah. You're not gonna like hurt me, right? <laughs> no. Okay. All right. Uh, could you two please roll initiative for me? Ones, <laughs> double yeah, one. Honestly, probably. Oh shit, that's not it. That's not initiative. <laughs> that's <laughs> investigation. <laughs> my bad. Where's my initiative? Hold on, I got it. Hey, yo, kid is out here. Kid. Oh, out here. kid, you're top of the initiative, actually. What a legend! I'm so proud. Am of I kid. still rolling when I do that? Okay, never mind. What do you mean? Cool. I was yeah, just clicking that's... the button a bunch because I didn't know it was going to. <laughs> Yeah, no, you rolled. You rolled a 17. Okay. And oh, Chester, Chester, you're at the bottom of the initiative. Yeah. <laughs> let's go. All right, let's... You know what? I'm just going to look up Gladiator music. Yeah. <laughs> Do the uh, Gladiator thing from uh, Hollow Knight. Oh, yeah. Uh, Champion Fool's Den or whatever. Champion of Fool's Den. Yeah. Am I still able to cast spells? Or do I get, like, killed? Do I get shot on sight if they see me make magic? No, no magic. You're gone. <laughs> I, I'm... Wait. 
Um, you can't, you can't use your spells without your deck of cards, so. Oh, okay. Oh, I'm stupid. Kid, the music changed. I'm scared. Oh, fuck. That it's getting cool. serious. All right, kid. Please Let's... take your turn. I run. <laughs> I run. And... Am I still in distance for a crossbow attack here? Um, you can right check. Guy? It's up to 120 feet. Oh, I'm definitely there. Yep. Okay. Yeah. Uh, Keep I in mind, make... the actual dirt of the Coliseum is 160 feet long, so most people you'll be able to hit. All right. Uh, let me roll that real quick and see if I hit. So which one are you targeting? Uh, Just here. How do I pin it? Uh, just you should hold left click. You should you should do the ones closest to me. That would that would be nice. No, that's your problem. <laughs> You're really getting competitive I, I here. It's it's the what here. You can hold Fine. down. You can... like yeah. I'm, you I, I'm doing that. It's left click, right? Yeah. 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 You want to shoot here, actually? Here, it factually is Don't your shoot problem. Under... I'm just rolling oh, over. You gotta it. go back to your select. You're, you're on your I mean, I'm doing. Wheel. I'm doing. Yeah, that one, that one. You're, you the just want. I, do, you, do you want. You, you can turn <laughs> off your ruler, man. I, I know. I know. I can see which one you're shooting at. Roll. <laughs> okay. Watch this drive. <laughs> oh, <laughs> kids about to start fucking cranking. I'm gonna do something real crazy here. Come on, man, it's a button, just press it. Like <laughs> I'm doing it! Alright, you deal oh five damage to this, sir. Alright. Next up is the bandit initiative. This guy will go 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, and come up to you. Um, and that'll be his turn. Um, next, why'd you move? Sorry. Um, next will be this dude. 5, 10, 15. He will come up. He will come. Alright. Uh, uh, bing bong, bing bong. Yeah, fuck yankee. him up, fuck him up, bandit. Fuck him up. Go ham, go ham. Kill go stupid. Go crazy. Murder, murder. <laughs> Alright, and whoa. Trying to keep this as fast as I possibly can. <laughs> surely a moment it I'm absolutely truly is enthralled at the moment are you is that real yeah i'm i don't want to die okay miss miss this guy is going to go um the guard the guard's fighting now no it's it's just tokens it's just tokens that are you know holy shit <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Yeah, on this that guard going wild! Bro. Damn! <laughs> He's going stupid. Fucking him up, bro. <laughs> going hell. The guard is pissed. Oh, that guard is just uh, not that going one misses, hell. And then this one comes down and hits you. Yes, sir, no! I'm oh, gonna die. Shit. Like this. <laughs> five <laughs> <did. I'm> one... <laughs> Oh shit. Oi, I die. Yeah, because your AC is 11. All right, now, finally. Chester. Okay. Chester dies instantly. Oh, oopsie. Oopsie, oopsie. That's not right. Uh, bing bong, bing bong. Chester's already low. Yeah. I'm not surprised. He has like 9 HP. I had opportunities for you guys to level up before you decided to challenge the Coliseum, but you want to know nope. what you guys didn't do? <laughs> <laughs> this is what I are gonna was fucking this, win this shit. Uh, yeah, they, we're not fucking cowards. Let's get this shit. All right, um, and Chester, your turn. Uh, I mm, want to disengage and run away. <laughs> All right. How far do I get to run? Thirty feet. Also, disengage 30. costs your action. I know. You have like a <laughs> healing word or something, right? I can't. Imagine. No spells. Yeah, you. No all... spells. Hold on, let me see if that's like far enough. He also doesn't learn cleric spells unless he takes a certain subclass. So. <clears throat> there we go. <laughs> <laughs> all right. That last five feet, dude. 
<laughs> it's important. Really hates the struggle. Kid. <laughs> All right, watch this shit. You ready? Fucking I'm ready. grappling a strength check. Um, yes. Okay, fuck it. Go ahead. Let's, Let's go, Let's kid. Kill him. Kill him. So you're, okay. going, you're going to grapple him? I'm going to grapple him with my hempen rope and sort of like strangle him. You, you don't have rope anymore. Yeah, because... I do. Oh, they took it off? Take yeah, you, they took everything off you. Strangle uh, him with your bare hands, kid! Do it! No. Okay, I'll fucking bite his ass. Nah, you nah, got nah. this, kid! Bite him. Uh, oh, yeah! Pretty pretty bite move. Do it, pussy. When you go down, you don't disappoint me. Oh, that's max Ooh. damage! Yeah, fuck Let's him up! Go. I'm cracked! As you bite into him, his, like, shoulder kind of goes, pss, 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 like, as blood splurts out. Into your yeah. mouth. Get him, kid. Get him. Bloodlust. He yeah. still barely stands, and as you do that, he will retaliate with a strike. Yeah. And will hit for four damage. No. No. He did not. No. Um. Now I just need to. Bam. Dude, Chester's Bam. gonna need to come in clutch here. Chester's gonna. Oh, that's him. another uh, crit. So this guard <laughs> is slain as he falls to the yeah. ground. Let's go. Um, as he moved 20 degrees. <laughs> no. <laughs> next. I floop the pig. Next, this acolyte is slain as. I'm just going to do this so you guys don't make fun of me. <laughs> <laughs> um, and then finally. When I turn 90 degrees. Finally, this acolyte is also slain. Murder. All right. Um, also, if you guys were planning on like not dying, I would recommend calling out the white flag before you get to zero HP because you will be unconscious at that point. Just throwing that out hey. there. Um, guard. I'm I'm considering it at the moment. No, no, no. Yeah. You gotta run crossbow this guy, and then I'll take on the mantle. <laughs> <laughs> you gotta drop shot, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Take him out while you leave. <laughs> right, and that's a miss. Take him okay. Out <laughs> and bam, bam. Okay, and okay. All right, Chester, your turn. Um. Yeah. I'm surprised. You know what you need to do. Turn. I'm gonna go right up to my buddy here. And Give I'm me gonna, that sneak attack. Yes. I'm gonna. <laughs> I'm, I'm, <laughs> uh, I'm gonna do this at this guy. And at the guy that's nigh dead. You just stole his kill, bro. No, You're that's the wrong dude. dude. <laughs> oh. Kill steal. No, that guy. he's got it. He's got that guy. Okay. Yeah. 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 Kill the guy that almost killed you. Andrew, hello. Hello. Andrew. All right, hello. that's it. I, hello, I take hello. a bite. I take it back. I'm actually gonna bite kid. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I retaliate. I I counter it. Sorry, I'm back. I what bite even do? more. I, I'm back. <laughs> what do you want me to do? Oh, you uh, bite? No, I don't bite. I crossbow. This guy is the first crossbow roll I did. Oh, okay, um, that'll deal two damage, and um, as the arrow sort of plunges into his chest, he will fall to the ground. Uh, Damn. And he'll just go, Arr! and fall over. <laughs> nah. Let's Arr! fucking go. Kid, more like shit. It is your turn. Okay. <laughs> Since I'm next to Chester, I get sneak attack, right? Yeah. Okay, let's fucking go. Uh, why, is, why is he ooh. dead already? Because you killed no, him? No, that's the, that's the wrong guy. Oh, I wait, you didn't shoot him? him? In no! I figured no. you'd shoot him to help Kid out, but uh, if no, Kid's got no, it. No, you bastard! Kid's got it. Right. I don't think I do. You literally do. It, I take it was two health. I have All right. four. I have five health. You did two damage okay. to that guard up there. Yes. I'm gonna. Yeah, I'm gonna bite this guy. All right. Roll it. With sneak attack. You, you don't get sneak attack. You're not within five feet of him. 
that's the button throw. Oh, 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 oh. Alright, the button. Let's you go. hit him for two damage. And Holy shit. Oh, yeah, you as did it. As as your, this, like, every other time. As your bite deepens into his shoulder, you take a chunk of it and sort of spit it into the ground. Hey, yummy. That was fucked up. <laughs> yummy. How's the, how's the blood taste, kid? Yummy. Alright, bandits. <laughs> I can't believe you just did that. That was horrific. <laughs> Yummy. <laughs> Yummers. Oh my god, they keep critting. I am horrified so at the moment. Sad. Good thing it's not towards us. I yeah. look at I look at Chester with bloodthirsty eyes. <laughs> oh, listen, buddy, I, I'm, I'm not. Hey, you're good. Don't hurt me. Kill Chester. Don't hurt me. Four plus five. Uh... Okay, and then he will smite this guard down, and so ends the bam bam. Uh, one. So, all right, then. Why am I getting messaged on Discord? I'm saying hi. Oh, thank you. Kid, I think our plan should be to take out the healthiest looking ones. All right. The ones that I use as a human shield. N what? <laughs> All right, Chester. Chester, my man. Uh, I'm shooting this boy again with um, with my light crossbow. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, you can That'll hit deal. anybody. So that uh, as your uh, he'll sort of like turn around after killing that dude uh, to look at you uh, after shooting him in the crossbow. Shooting him in the, like, sort of calf with your crossbow. And he will turn around, and as he does that, you shoot him dead in the mouth. And he... Oh, damn! Runs <laughs> over. Two I kills on the board one. right now. Just wiped out the Coliseum. Jeez. Alright, kid. Shit. Okay. Uh... You can hit that anybody. One. Yeah, that one. I'm going to use my. Are you gonna move over to get sneak attack? I will move over to get sneak attack. Let's go sneak attack time! Oh boy! Kid, we're actually Love doing sneak it. Attack. Yes. Now, now throw we'll... Chester towards the guards. <laughs> <laughs> now I'll do it. He picks me up with one hand. He tosses me fucking I like. I hurl you. <laughs> it fucking he hurls you out of the car. <laughs> and you stab an arrow into one of the guard, into one of the eyes of the bandits. <laughs> Launch right. him um, using the crossbow. <laughs> that will actually hit. Or I did. Tasty. Now roll your sneak attack. This could kill. <laughs> yeah, you worked up white boy with the sauce. You dinked the man. You dinked him, bro. It's a D4, right? Uh, it's a D6, I believe. D6, ooh. Where is my D6? Yeah, it's a 1D6. Uh, you can roll it in your features. Oh, your I found it, yep. Ability. I got you, I got you. Um, that'll deal 5 extra damage, and as he is hit by surprise, he will um, be crossbowed in the back of the head and fall down in front of his got him. He was, he was dinked him, bro. from full health. That's you wild. dinked him! <laughs> All right, three and... kills on the board right now. I like to you imagine know, I he actually he only got worse. shot once. It just like surprised him, so he died of shock. <laughs> oh, no. oh no! That'll miss, and he... my true power. I just shot people. <laughs> Bye. Really scary. Then it will do this guy's turn. I don't know what he's even hitting. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25. You see that? It's because I'm on fire right now. It's this dude. And There's you know so many dead bodies. Um, at, at this point, you can hear the crowd roaring, but Chester, it is your turn. Yeah! I'm gonna shoot this guy. Alright, that'll hit and kill him. Yeah! Murder! Let's go, Chester! Two people. Left. Then I, I, I run in circles Let's go, again. Chester, I believe in you. You run in circles for all your movement. Where do you end? Oh, right here. <laughs> all right, kid. What, you what does the crowd do? I want to know the reaction. Um, yes. they're they're like sort of changing favor towards you now. A lot of yeah, uh, a Let's lot go. of uh, 
Raymar, Earl, you guys see a lot of people in the crowd with sort of this scorn as they realize that their bets might be misplaced. Yeah. Because you get my gun ready. How do you bet against the shark man? Okay. I will crossbow the one with more health in the back. If I can hit that. Yeah, you, you should be able to. Just because, like, someone's in yep. front of it. Uh, let me see. Roll. Alright, that'll hit. And that will strike him in the them. dome and take him out. <laughs> wow, we, we got some, like, You're good... sniping! You and I, kid. Alright. I don't... <laughs> you win this. Yeah, I gave them Unless to you roll roll really when we are on the boat. He can't even, like, reach us. <laughs> He's just gonna run at you and die. Yeah, oh no! <laughs> he will run after you and Chester. It's your turn. He stops right there. Chester, and take a execute, breath. execute. Yeah, he stops Odyssey. in time right there. You, <laughs> he's frozen as you take gonna, your action. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go right oh. up behind. I'm gonna as he as he's gasping for air because that was a very long jog. I'm gonna go up behind <laughs> him and I'm gonna shoot him at point blank range in the back of the head. <laughs> And execution he will topple over and die <laughs> let's go <laughs> which all right um, earl cheers he he's clapping yeah you see everybody he, in the crowd uh <laughs> clapping and cheering. it's just you and i left now kid <laughs> oh no execute. and kid it's your turn <laughs> with bloodthirsty eyes no listen <laughs> wait wait listen we could we could like what what if i play dead you don't have to hurt me Kid isn't listening. <laughs> no, kid is no, <laughs> kid no. fucking rushes and like in the heat of the moment, not paying fucking attention. No, you can fucking it, kill me. I seeing red. I will non-lethally bite him. Oh, you will non-lethally. Okay. And <laughs> oh, as he crits you down, like, okay, you'll feel the the you'll be like, hey, buddy, we can work this out. As he's like running at you, and all you feel is a sharp pain in your arm, and you black out. <laughs> <laughs> non lethally bitten. All right. And a sticker for my bet bets one. And the crowd will erupt. <laughs> oh god, he killed Chester. I do like the little flexing thing again. All right. And this time, <laughs> instead of met with awkward silence, you will be met with eruptus roaring as you <laughs> are the champion. Arnold? Arnold Swerton? So, um, you put 20 into each of them, right? Yep. And what about you, Earl? Uh, I did not bet. You did not bet, okay. Um, oh, fucking idiot. So... <laughs> okay, Tasty. betting odds calculator. <laughs> the bet amount is 20. 20 and I lost one, 20, two, but three, I gained four, more. Six, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Okay, so it'd be technically 2 out of 14, I believe. And also, I'm not sure. That's There's 14 competitors. I don't know how much other people would bet. I'm pretty sure that's also a factor. I'm not sure. Yeah, we, there was supposed to be history check, so it could have been like a guy that was important, right? Is there a big gladiator man that was well known here? No, that Maybe. was well, not necessarily gladiator man. It was, he was just dude, it was the, the guy that like sits up here, the big, the big, yeah. Big man. All right, the so booth man. You lose forty gold and make back eighty gold. Perfect. Oh, so a net gain of forty gold um, from That's his victory yeah. because he was kind of an underdog. It wasn't expected. We're falling out, but. If Chester won, that would be more if money. If Chester won, you probably would have made closer to 160 gold. <laughs> God damn it, kid. Um, Come on, kid. But yeah, that will end our gladiatorial escapades. That will end our that session. End. That went great. Like, literally, right after, like, this is done, uh, and, you know... However, Chester gets dragged out of the Coliseum. Uh, I would like to heal Chester. All right, yeah. I appreciate um, that. You guys uh, can just do your things and 
the little Sick. crowd section here. So I'm just gonna snicker and walk towards the betting box. Um, am, I, am I up now? Yes. I'm a little, um, I'm a little woozy. Uh, Earl, cast good berry. The best spell. And you heal him for 10 HP because he chomps down on all the berries? Or do you uh, distribute them? You'll need uh, uh, Chester, how much health do you have right now? And Chester, Chester. Three. Oh, okay. Oh, wait, you can fully three. heal both of them if you would like. Oh, yeah, I heal, fully heal both of them. Why did you minus five? That's not right. <laughs> hey, you guys are the bad right. berry. <laughs> the bad berry. <laughs> okay. Okay. There we go. All right. Um, <laughs> These really are good. some good berries. You were right. <laughs> you had good old spell yes, slot down. Couple. Kid, how much um, money yep. did you make from that? Oh, yes. I, I forgot. Um, so the mustachioed man will sort of walk down from the arena and will uh, say, Ah, my glorious winner. Hello. Hello there. I'm just looking for the bunny. All right, well, he will pull out a small brown uh, leather sack and he will hand it to you. Here you go, my friend. Wait, sir, who are you? You seem very important. Oh, me? My name is... Bing Bing Bong? Bing Bong Bing? Uh, oh, nice wow. to meet you, Bing Bing Bong, Bing Thank Bong you. Bing. <laughs> uh, my name is Arthur McCormick. Arthur McCormick. <laughs> nice to meet you. That sounds like a made-up name, I like it. Nice to meet you too, my friend. Do you know anywhere <laughs> I can get something I can smoke? Some herbs, if you will? Ah, yes, there are tons of areas around here where you can gather various smokable things. Uh, like where? Um, just to visit a local smoke shop. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> Thank you. Of course. Yes. Of the What's the way? What do you recommend? I don't personally smoke, so oh, fucking I have man. my mind focused other places. Yeah, like watching people kill each other. Well, yes. I simply run this establishment. Did I don't find is it, is quite like enjoyment a for you? Happen. Oh, that's fair. Yeah, that's respectable at least. I bet it's profitable. It is. Does McCormick get their money? What you ask? Is how the McCormicks get their money from the noble guys? Would you oh, like no, to no, see no. a magic Okay, trick? <laughs> um, if you're if you're asking about how uh, the McCormick noble line gets their money, then you may roll a history check. I think that's what you were asking. I'm like. I had trouble hearing you. Yeah, I was just asking if that was how they got their money. Um, yeah, make a history check. If you know any- or are you asking him? I was asking him, but- uh, oh, that's great. Well, <laughs> he, he replies, um, Oh, we, we have our hands in a bit of everything. It's not necessarily a Coliseum thing. I see. Hey, uh, do you have any, like, gold to spare for the smoke shop? Because, like, um, <laughs> Unfortunately, like a, a I don't give pain. out bones. I'm in like a lot of pain. All right, I really he's need... just gonna start walking I'm... away. Back no, to come his back. <laughs> so, I'm gonna how much you with off of that? Um, and you open the sack, and you have made 150 gold. The kid, oh, God, yeah. the kid, give me 50 Good of that. Job, you kid. fucking, you almost ripped my arm off. Hey. Do you give him 50? I'm sorry, here. I give him 50. Yeah, Appreciate we'll split that. it. I'll put that in my. You did good work out there, kid. Not I did not, yeah, not what Chester, I was no. at. <laughs> Chester, you also did pretty good. Appreciate but that. Kid, I thought you almost killed Chester. Um, I'm... E. Don't worry, bro. The guy doesn't come chat. until level 5. He wouldn't do that. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we're not taking over the world until, like, level 6. Alright, and um, I assume you all... Like, actually go do things that aren't the Coliseum now? Yeah. yeah. Actually, uh, I'll be right back. I need to get something. See you guys. See you guys. Okay. Back to the Freedmen's Gather, man. Alright, I'm going to find someone, roll a deception check, and give them oil, and get, they give me money. That's <laughs> what I'm doing. Alright, so you're just approaching someone random? Yes. <laughs> Alright. Um, You find a sort of stout... Uh, 
you see sort of a stout little halfling man with a handlebar mustache and uh, aviators. Um, hey, this guy's cool. Shit. And he will say, cool guy here. Hey, hey, how's it going, man? How you doing? I'm cool. What great, you man. need, Nothing buddy? What you need? Help you out. I got a knee. Like, I got a knee for you. Uh, what'd you say, my friend? I got uh, mighty fine snake oil. It'll heal whatever you wish and do whatever you want it to do. Ah, does it uh, cure a bad back? Of course it can. Um, roll a funny deception check. Roll mm. for deception. Damn, good ass roll. Wait, you have a mi do you have a minus two to deception? That was it my roll. Oh. Yeah, that was mine. Uh, I didn't see it. Oof. Just under. That would have been really funny if you had a minus two just. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He's just a deceiver. I'll give you advantage on that. Because he, he doesn't know ass. you. He's a new. And go, this will all be yours. I, I said I'll give you advantage. Justin? Justin? Bye -bye. Yeah, I, I'll, roll I'll another deception you, check. Yeah, roll another deception check. Okay. Let's see. Let me go back to my, my crit, guy. Crit, 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 crit. Uh, Bruh. I don't. I don't know if I'm that interested in snake oil right now. Uh, how do you how do you source it? How do you source your material? Do you actually get it from snakes? I get it from an old source of my old friend from when I was younger. Uh, so, how old is this uh, snake oil then? At most about a week old. I get, I get fish. Ah. Hmm. One of the funniest for my customers. Uh screw it. I'll buy a couple. How much did uh, you say that was? One is ten gold today. Ugh, ten gold. Mm. Here, I'll buy one. I'll buy one. And he'll hand you a small pouch of ten gold. <laughs> I should bring business with you, my friend. I'll get it back is better. Ah, me too, my friend, me too. Just the JFK voice from Clone High. <laughs> <laughs> I heard. Uh... It's, like, it's more like Patrick Warburton. A little bit, yes. Yeah. <laughs> nice score out there, Ray. It's as usual, my friend. All right. <clears throat> is there anything else you guys are interested in doing? Like <clears throat> checking I... out any of the shops? I, I would. I would is love there to go no... to a smoke shop. I I wanted to go to a. Some sort of magic shop. A magic food. shop. Yes. <laughs> um. So, would you mind if we went to the magic shop first, Mister oh! Nono? No. Okay. I want we? <laughs> you guys can do it yourselves. <laughs> All right. Oh boy. <clears throat> so, uh, are you all going in or just? Uh, I'll go in. I'm definitely going in. <laughs> Why go does that in. look like fucking? Where's his name? Never mind. He he looks like Jim Carrey's Doctor Robotnik. <laughs> <laughs> you know. <laughs> hey, look, it's an emerald. Enough. He looks enough like that. For me to <laughs> not does. get mad at you. He has the chaos emeralds. <laughs> A chaos emerald, sir. <laughs> Ah, you're looking at those gemstones. Yes, sir. Where are these from? It makes uh, them magic. They're from Aura. I, quite frankly, don't know what exactly makes them magic, but I believe no, they're so components cool. for crafting. Can I roll an Arcana check for that? Yeah, roll an Arcana check. Alright, um, he seems almost exactly right that these can be, uh, harvested to craft, um, uh, sort of, uh, magical items. 
uh, you can sort of forge them next to something you already own to increase its magical property, or use it next to a mundane weapon to add a magical property to it. Ooh. I will buy. Um, okay. How much do you say these were? Ah, one of those will run you 150 gold pieces. Oh, my goodness. Of which you do not have that much. <laughs> um, what, what, what is your name, sir? Oh, me? My name is Mason. Mason? Yes. Um, I, I have a question for you. Um, I'm always open to questions. How familiar are you with... What, what's the word? Finding out what a magic item does, if you don't know what it does? I am capable, but not an expert by any means. Mm, well, I, I, I do have one question for you, and uh, Earl kind of reaches into his pocket, pulls out this little thing wrapped in leather, and pulls out just a pearl. Um, this, I don't... I've been holding on to this for a long time. I don't know exactly what it does, but it, it, it is magical, I can tell you that. Which, and I kind of... Which thing did you... Oh, the it, pearl? The echo pearl. The echo pearl. Yes, yes, yes. Um, um, can you tell me what this does? And I kind of set it on the table. All right. Uh, so he will attempt to identify it. You know what All right. Said. Um, he will say, hmm, "This seems like when it's broken, it will release something." Mm. I can't exactly tell what, but it seems as though there's something trapped inside of it. That is, that is nice to know, thank you. I don't exactly know where it came from, well, I have an idea, but it, that's not for certain. But thank you for your time. Are you and... looking to sell it, perchance? Hmm... No, not exactly. Unfortunate. Uh, let me take a look at your wares. And, okay, I'm gonna... What would be a good thing to look? A at? knife. A <laughs> knife. <laughs> a so, knife. <laughs> looking through this magic items, you uh, find a common theme that most of these are severely out of your budget. Hmm. But they're not out of kids' budget. This man just want to hold like I step over. Mo mo most of them are out of kids' budget too. <laughs> Fuck, <laughs> not all. I run back. <laughs> uh, Kid, are you seeing this shit? I know it's fucking crazy, dude. Yeah, dude, that's like a that's like a cup with a, ma a face on it. <laughs> I'm looking uh, at a hat. I'm looking at a real wizard's hat right now. Here, here, look, Chester. I'll make it up to you. Look, I'm sorry. I'm really sorry about what I did there. You go distract him with your funny card bullshit, all right? Uh huh. I'm gonna, I'm gonna take something. Okay, okay. <laughs> Hello, sir. Ah, uh, are you strapped for cash? Uh, I don't know what that means, but do you want to see a cool card trick? Mm, not particularly. I'm on the oh, job. Oh, right? come on! It's, it, come on! Look at, tell, look at how cool this is. All right, cards will begin flying around. Please make a sleight of hand check, kid. All right. Right. <laughs> All right. Um, as you are distracting him, he will make a perception check at disadvantage. Why? Oh and, fuck! Ah! Oh. Um, uh. As you sort of attempt to put it into your robe, he will. Look at you and be like, "Hey, hey, buddy, buddy, put that back, put that back." I, I didn't, I didn't touch it. Come uh, here, run over here. <laughs> come here, buddy, come here. Hey, wait, hey, me, me, you talking to yeah, me? Yeah, yeah. He like points at you and he's like, "Come here." He doesn't seem threatening. Okay, I walk over now. Look, I, I get it. I've been there. You all don't have a lot of money for items like this, do you? <laughs> Not particularly. No. Well. How about this? A little bit of uh, 
You scratch my back, I scratch yours. That's gross. Look, I will give you a small selection of my wares that I'm willing to part with. If you that all... That wizard hat? Unfortunately, no. Fuck! No, I'm out of here. But if you all are willing to do a small favor for me, well, I will that... let you all partake in some of my items. What may what is... this favor be? Uh, it's nothing too complex. In the basement of this place, uh, there's a bit of a problem I've been running into. Some of my, uh, let's call it, materials are being ravaged by some sort of rat infestation. I don't know um, hey guys, exactly I'm back. where it originates, and I... I decided I'll listen to this guy. I'm sorry for leaving all the sun. <laughs> What'd you say? <laughs> Hold on, I'll actually be right back. <laughs> um, Chester, he said he has some sort of rat infestation in the basement. Oh my fucking god, I have to hear this shit again, I swear. He's fucking racist. Okay then. I, I don't think he's racist. Uh, I think he's just having some rodent trouble. Happens every now and again. And then, like, you just hear from outside the store, This guy's racist! <laughs> <laughs> this guy hates skinwalkers! <laughs> <laughs> we start um, holding up signs in protest. Um, so <laughs> what do you all think? Uh, do you think this deal is worth it? I come uh, back in with a sign that says, like, I don't know, some protesty it, shit. It, it, no, it's, yeah. on the back of the, it's on the back of the mom's business card. <laughs> <laughs> Earl, you should be out here protesting with me. You hear what this guy just said? I mean, yes, but every so often there are- Oh, people. you're one of them! Oh! Empathizer. <laughs> Look. <sighs> yeah, th mm. I couldn't have said it better myself, buddy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what are you listening? You're not even out here. here. <laughs> it's not even here. How are you listening? <laughs> I I think it might be worth it to partake this deal. I can't wait for us to go in the basement and then it's like fucking like actual dragons down there. It's just <laughs> a bunch of rat folk just vibing. <laughs> They're all smoking weed in the basement. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it turns out this guy's like actually racist. <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. We might be like able to pursue Chester's in his basement. Yeah, they're all just multiple Chester's. <laughs> He's only just pretending <laughs> to care about us. Clones of me. This guy actually just hates Skinwalker. He just said that that business. <laughs> he's he's like Eggman, so he's gonna take all the, us animals and have Sonic on. Like, try to kill him. I don't think Sonic kills him. Okay. He should. So, okay. from the items on the table, which ones are y'all most interested in? I really wanted the wizard hat. I'm sad kid the enchantment steal. rock. Uh, I think I want... Either that weird blue thing next to that weird lion puppet. I think that's some type of, like, canteen or something. And... Or, or maybe... God, what is that cracked stone thing? Is it just a giant stone face? Um, the thing with the there... face on it? Yeah. Are you thinking about the brain here? No, no, top of the building, top of the building. Oh, that? Yeah. That's but, the boy. If we get to choose our magic items from any of these, I think I'm going to either pick that one or this. I was trying to take the fat ass gym thing. Which thing? Like the big ass like blood cell. <laughs> that's a hat. Yeah. That's a hat. Oh, that's 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 what I was talking about. That's the straw hat we need.
to become pirates. Not very smart. It knows what a blood cell is, but doesn't know what it is. <laughs> you know, the funny thing is, like, stats-wise, Chester is really smart, but he just doesn't have common sense. Like, intelligence is his highest stat. And he just knows a bunch of random shit. Yeah, literally. His dad just taught him a bunch of facts. <laughs> Look, my what character's highest stat is literally dexterity. <laughs> And I'm a I'm a druid, which needs wisdom. Mine's charisma. Nerd. Wait, no, what, what is, what is kids' highest? Stat? I like to imagine they're just all at ten. <laughs> <laughs> you save him for later. <laughs> well, you guys don't even know yet. <laughs> Anyways, uh, just get funny. back in here, or else. What happened? This is the threat. Hey, chat. Everyone's here, right? Hi, chat. Yeah. yeah. Hi. So he will, like, continue, and he'll be like, Yes, um, I apologize if it's a bit insensitive to you. And he'll, like, look at Earl, but... Um, <laughs> but, um... Yes, the, the rat infestation has gotten quite bad. If you can at least oh. remove them and not kill them, that would be appreciated. Listen, buddy, I just got done protesting with a sign outside of your store saying that you're a racist. <laughs> But I'll Racist? Do it. I don't care. I, and he'll um, <laughs> he'll like sort of whisper an incantation, and this wall will open, revealing a staircase. Um, wait. And he hold will on. Say, Before we go down there, can I ask you some? Yes, of course. What do you know? What do you, do you know? Have any idea what this could be? At the fucking the the skull. The monkey skull. The monkey skull. Yeah. I'm rolling the blood monkey skull. Right. Yeah, I forget. I almost forgot about that. Go the blood monkey. We all we know is that we, if we cover it with blood, it will do something. Yeah, I was gonna say. Can you tell me anything other than the fact if I cover it with blood that it will probably like explode or something? This is unrecognized to me, but um, it seems to have some necromantic energy pouring out of it. Necromancy. <laughs> Necromancy is a very... Sorry, I burped. Alright, let's go into your basement thing. Did Chester canonically burp? Yes, <laughs> it burped in his face. <laughs> like in the middle of him talking, just like stop something <laughs> and unleash a burp. <laughs> or the term with the red fit in position gun, sir. It looks like rocks in my pocket. If I will say, um, it would be best to probably do this non-lethally. We might be able to relocate them somewhere. But if we have now to... you care about the rats all of a sudden. Uh, no, I wasn't care. going to kill them in the first place. If we uh -huh. have to, we... If we have to, we have to, but... Mm. If we can just relocate them, that would be nice. I'm not a fan of this rat-on-rat -rat crime. The light's on someone, please. Oh, you guys can't see, can you? Uh, yeah, I don't have. I do that folk have dark vision. I don't remember. No, it's not. Speak. It's not like super dark in here. There's actually even a light. No, it's so dark no. that we get blinded. It's so dark we just can't see. It's too bad. We're blind. <laughs> all right. So you all come into a basement, and um, so contrary to what it looks like, um, a lot of these tables are thrown on the ground, bottles smashed. Damn. So it looks like there's a rat infestation in here. <laughs> That's crazy. Um, <laughs> um, something you I'm immediately notice is the floor is covered in sort of a sticky substance. <laughs> in rats. <laughs> 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 We're just stepping on them. It's like a squish um, every step. <laughs> Earl, Earl is going to take out a ration. Uh, what is it? A dry food suitable for extended travel. Including jerky, dried fruit, hardtack, and nuts. He's going to take the dried fruit, uh, hardtack, and nuts and kind of put it in the center of the floor. No. Just to, like, lure out some of the rats. <laughs> so, like, right here? Yeah, about, about. Alright. Um, you... As you do that, you'll hear a... Like a sort of... Noise. Mm. 
Delightful. Hey man, are you gonna eat um, those? And it emanates um, from here. I'll, I'll give you some later, Chester. But oh, uh, okay. Oh, um, Earl kind of pushes it a little bit closer to the grate to see if you know whatever is in there can come out of there. You'll hear like a continued. Hey, that doesn't mm. sound like a rat. I think I would know being a rat. Um. I would like to see if I can tell whatever is, you know, in there. Kind of like look in there, see what's under there. All right. As you look in, you see sort of this um, giant sort of. Actually, first make me a nature check. Nature check? Oh, boy. I'm a druid. I should be good at these. But am I? You should. I have. Per I, I have the funny. <sighs> Oh, and that one. That was canonical too. All right. Um, you okay. see a sort of large. Um, I I guess you would see it as sort of this liquidy, um, thick, yellow substance. Mm. Oh no! Nah. What is he doing down here? <laughs> it's... Um. What do you, What do you see, Earl? What is that? It's some type of yellow or yellow thick substance i can't really tell what it is but i believe it's making the noise can i uh, roll a smell check <laughs> can i smell this thing uh roll a perception okay <laughs> <laughs> he critted it let's go let's go chester crit on smell crit on smell <laughs> all right Exactly that, what we heard is about literally the volume of Chester sniffing. That puddle <laughs> down there smells alive. Guys, this thing smells alive. Wow. How can you tell that from smell? I, did, I have a really good sense of smell. Um, Like, literally, place cheese, I think, approximately 67 feet away from me, and I'll be able to tell you what kind of cheese it is. Um, can I roll a perception or investigation check to see if there is actually any rats down here? To see if Chester is lying. Oh. <laughs> no, not. No, I'm trying to see if it is actually a rat problem or this know. might be the source of the problem. I need you know? to know if you can actually smell cheese that far. <laughs> <laughs> That's an experiment for later. That all is an right, experiment right. for later. Please roll and I guess investigation to see if there's any trails of rats rat trail moment let's go let's see Ten. Uh, I love you it. you can't see anything specifically guiding you to rats but you see no evidence otherwise mm. oh so you're telling me this guy Earl. so what you're telling me is that this guy just blamed it on rats huh um he you might see have, where i'm coming uh, from now? look i don't think he doesn't think it's rats i don't think he knows it's not rats i just don't think he knows better it might be uh, Earl kind of points to the great. I think it might be whatever's in there. Wow! Well, well, I didn't. I, um, you Earl got takes great perception. Earl uh, takes some of the heart, like a piece of hard tech, kind of drops it into the grate. All right. As you do so, um, it'll so sort of start rumbling like waves roaring on a shore and begin expanding up to the grate oh, and as this happens please everybody stop where you are and make i said fucking stop where you are all right um and make me stop where you are an initiative end roll. of the session initiative time oh boy oh my god yeah that wasn't too bad I rolled pretty good initiative there. Good job, Chester. That was like his first good initiative roll. Roll the dice. <laughs> Earl, the, the one who caused this. I forgot. I forgot. There's an initiative. Uh, it's a, uh, right there. Let's go. <laughs> Let's go. Go right after my good man. Let's kill some shit. Alright, um, and please give me a moment. Also, Andrew, can, you, can you roll for my spells? I believe oh, yes. we did that last session, but if you forgot or you don't have the paper, you run it down on the desk. I he may have for gore. No, no, no. I should, I should, I should, I should. 
All right. And as you back away, you see this erupt from the grave. Oh, the goop! The goop! The goop! Oh, never mind. It's gone. I don't know where it is. All right. Um. Here, I'll roll it for you. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, Jelby. That's negative one on initiative, boys. Do we get an extra turn? He, he doesn't Let's move go. at all. Actually, oh, he moves backwards. <laughs> Spell card table. Um, please roll do two d tens. Uh, is that like slash r or what? Uh, slash r space d ten. Space d ten. Okay. Uh, wait. Can't believe it. Devil Hold may on. cry time. There you go. Moment. Oh. All right, burning hands and false light. You got wow. this. I got a good one and like a. You you might want to be careful with that burning hands. I'm just gonna tell you that. You can't tell me what I'll to do. I'll be fine. All right. All right. Um, please start us off, Earl. Okay. Earl does not have many combat spells, so what Earl is going to do... It, does there happen to be any, like, small rocks on the ground? Or small rocks in general? In the general area? Any small cocks on the ground? There's broken bottles. Yeah, there's a, bit of, if, there's a bit of rubble in the area you can use for a catapult. Or a magic um, stone, depending on which you want. I, I don't have catapult, but I do have magic stone. So what I'm going to do... Magic stone time, baby! Ooh. That, that, All right, that's um, that's your bonus action. Uh, that's my bonus action and action, because right. I'm using my action to throw a magic stone. Um, and that will hit Shit. for six bludgeoning. Tasty, tasty. All right. And I'm just going to move a little bit away. I don't blame you. This thing's kind of menacing. Andrew, help! How to get rid of this thing? It's alright, I got you. Andrew, and that ends my turn. Can I ask you something? No. Yeah, go ahead. <laughs> all right. Oh, is Kid able to speak uh, before his turn, or is it like? Uh, speaking is a free action. You can speak yeah, okay. whenever. I am going to, in character, tell Chester hey. to hold uh, his. Is, is it uh, you? He does not have to listen to me, but I'm telling him to hold any of his spells that he might cast. Why? Look, I have my reasons, all right? Just, no, but just trust like, me. No, I don't. Last time I trusted you, you... I won't bite you this time, okay? Okay. Uh... One time thing. Look, I, okay. something just came over me, all right? It's not It's not going to happen again. I understand. <laughs> Quote, unquote, not going to happen again. All right. Okay. Um, Raymar, it is your turn. Yes, I got to use my funny daggers. Eleven. All right. Um, that does four <laughs> damage. Eleven. <laughs> Eleven. Eleven. All right. Will that end your turn? Yes. Chester. <laughs> I, I want to go right here. I want. I want to. I wanna, um, you still have that crossbow, don't you? I do still have that crossbow. I, I will just... say, it is intimidating that we can't see the health. Block. I agree. Oh, you guys can't see the tel health? No. no. Yeah, no. There you go, sorry. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Okay. I was going to say, I want to try and talk to him. <laughs> talk I, feel like... My word. <laughs> I feel like you're misunderstood. Uh, talking is a free action, so... You... Blob creature, I feel like you're misunderstood. How, how did you get here? Yep. You know, guys, I think he has a point. I think we can, we can, he could be a great asset to our team. We all have something to learn from him, you know. Yeah, exactly. Aren't we all really? He's the a true blob speaker creatures? of the nations. Yeah, exactly. In our own rights, can't we all just? Aren't we all just blob creatures? I mean, I'm not very blobby. <laughs> okay, buddy, whatever you need to tell yourself. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> I'm gonna throw Three. my cards. Alright! Um. What? Alright, um, and what damage does that do? 
uh, one deals poison, two deals fire, uh, five deals acid. I, okay, uh, so as you strike him, it seems less effective. Hmm. Okay. It seems sure less not. effective than a normal attack would. You'll be sure not to roll a five next time you yeah, use that attack. Yeah, that's what I was gonna say. <laughs> Is that a that five? Yeah. It's five plus four. Ah, I see. Yeah. You can open the roll. <clears throat> uh, I, I, I did that. <laughs> All right. Uh, kid. I oh, will wait. By, the, use my by the way, you moved out of his range? Oh, was I in his range before? Uh, no, I'm talking to Chester. Oh, okay. Was I in his range? Oh, yeah. Yes. I was like right here, wasn't I? Yeah, and then you moved here. Uh, okay. I'm going to. You'll take to... the opportunity attack? Uh. <laughs> Uh, uh, Sorry to cut you off, bro. <laughs> I, you, you know what? I'm feeling pretty lucky. I'm gonna stand on top of this box and say yes. Yes, I do. All right. Look, magic missile. He <laughs> will. <laughs> oh, well done. <laughs> Chester, Chester dies. It's... <laughs> he will knock you. <laughs> <laughs> I just get slammed into the box like this. <laughs> oh. Yeah. Chester, no! As, as you're oh. running away, his goopy hands will sort of smack the back of your head like Michael motherfucking Jordan style. And then <laughs> knock you down face first into the boxes. As oh my god! Oh, it's jelly ballin'! Ballin'! Yeah, there's a rat problem here now. <laughs> <laughs> also, I'm just gonna do this real quick. Um, Earl kind of just yells... Nay said it's a bit more of a, than a rat problem. Even though, who knows, probably doesn't hear him. It's a rock. Did we leave the door open? Maybe he might. He yeah, might. Maybe. Roll for if you the door open. <laughs> <laughs> can I roll oh. to open the door? Can I Can I do a, a door? Uh, yeah, telepathically sound? open the door. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> Blah, blah, blah. Good, good, good turn. Oh, shoot, my bad. I thought you said okay. Uh, I will use my oil flask that I have in my inventory and sort of chuck it or like break it on him to try and get it all, all right. over him. Uh, normally, I'd have you, in oil. normally I'd have you roll, but like, you know, he's a big target and you're like that close. There's no reason Okay. To. But that uh, is my action. So, so you use the oil flask. Did it not put it in chat? Okay, well I used it for you. Um right. And then I'm gonna sort of flee over here. <laughs> go check Just... if the door's open. <laughs> <laughs> uh and then Oh like do it on here. Uh, and then I'll end my turn. Alright. Jelby turn. All right. All right. The jelly. Right. The jelly will sort of go, and it will attempt to strike out at Raymar. Oh no! Um. Jesus, man. Oh, jeez. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> one shot again. Man, I forget how weak level one characters are. Moment. <laughs> We're just wiping everyone out. All right, Raymar. Earl, Earl, and Kid have to carry now. That's fine. You you can heal them. I have good berry. I have to be like right next to them, and it takes an action to eat one berry. <laughs> eh, that's all right. Let's just have Crow open the door. Force one into Chester's mouth. Yeah. Why do I keep getting Discord pings, man? You say hello. Music. Alright. Earl. Earl. Earl time. Let's go. Earl time. Yeah. Um, Earl, first off, is going to kind of go under the table to... Earl. Wait. Uh, yeah, that's good enough. Moving. So, Earl kind of goes over by Chester kind of, you know, just to get closer to him, to, you know, so he can heal him later. But for now, 
what Earl is going to do is I'm pretty sure I might be able to use a spell like this, but it's the druid craft. You can instantly light or snuff out a candle, torch, or small campfire. Can I use druid craft to light the oil? On yeah. The line? Andrew. Read. What? I'm reading. Oh. Okay. It doesn't necessarily say that, but it, do it does allow me to light something. Like, light candle, torch, small campfire. Um, I'm gonna say yeah. So, Sick. you light him on fire, and let me... Alright, yeah. Sick. Uh, you light him on fire, and he will take five damage instantaneously. Sick. And that kind of is my turn for now, because that did take my turn. All right, croak Raymar. it up there. Uh, please make okay. a death saving throw, Raymar. Oobra, oobra. Where... Where the freak, bro? It's in your... It's just on your bar, I think. It's under initiative? Or around initiative? I see things. Uh, Attrib it's right under it's in attributes right above like size resource senses. one yeah it's right under resource one. Oh yeah it's all right that's Oof. unfortunately a fail all right um and as this happens mason will walk through and be like oh god what the hell is that thing yeah shit's getting fucky in here some sort of not right <laughs> The Latinus creature. <laughs> Perfect. All right. Um, and he will sort of call out, "Amor Shiga," and he will use his singular spell slot to bring. Who does he see first? All right, you. Hold on, let me make sure. That's... Oh yeah. Okay. It, it it was right. Sorry. Um, he. Bring Chester up to four. Let's go, Chester. Can I search inside? Oh, yeah, it's not my turn. Not yet. Kid. Yeah. Thank you. All right. So, there's like torches around the wall, right? Like something that's like a flame. Mm -hmm. Oh, God. Uh, trust me. <laughs> so, would it be possible for me to light one of my... Uh, crossbow bolts before taking an action and then shooting. Okay. Um, you could not do that because the torches aren't currently lit. But, um, so I, I will say he's, even... he's already on fire. You can't make he's him on more fire. on fire. I want more fire. <laughs> okay, wait. Person. The entire... Entire you know, I'll, just take, I'll take a pot shot at him then with my crossbow. All right, that deal six. All right, and then I'll sort of hide over here behind the railing, where I sort of cover. All right. Better. The jelly will go. Jelly. Actually, no, he won't move there. Um. Okay, he will. He'll go. Jesus. Okay. He'll move there. And it's Earl. Floppy. Earl time. Okay. Uh, can I? Yeah, I can move over there. Um, I would like to. Uh, no, stop. Okay. I'm going to, Earl's going to make his way over to Raymar and do what he does best. Cast Goodberry and kind of just put a couple into uh, Raymar's mouth and just kind of try and heal him that way. It's not or not the probably the best way to heal someone, but it's all, when it's all you have, you got to do what you got to do. Heal him for one. And... 
Hmm. Is there a way I could drag him? Like, out of the way? Yes, but it would have your movement. Okay, so I would be able to drag him five feet. Because I used 20 getting here. Yeah. So that would probably get him out of range. So and it won't trigger I... an opportunity attack, because if you're forced out of opportunity range, it doesn't trigger. Okay. Okay, yeah. Uh, Earl kind of drags Raymar out of distance. So five feet this way. There you go. All right, nice. Raymar, it's your turn. <laughs> no. Uh, <laughs> oh. I'm going to back up and use my funny gun. <laughs> uh, yeah. Uh, that. <laughs> uh, if you'd like to pull yourself back up, you can do control scroll wheel on, while selecting your token. No, you're not up yet. Buddy. I know, I know. I was just you said get up. I was just joking. I was just joking. <laughs> I, I know how I was kidding. doing it with him. It's a prank. I know how to move my. All gun. right, and you will hit him. Bang for seven damage. Going. Always rely on the gun. <laughs> <laughs> the gun is my end of the battle, sword. Uh, two people almost died. <laughs> he will continue moving down. Ah! Ah! And he will end his turn. Chester! And Chester's currently writhing in pain. <laughs> oh, wait, oh, also, me I, me I, too. I accidentally made a mistake. When you get up, you have your movement, so you could have only moved to there. It's not a big difference, it's just like. And All what right, would you I'll... like to do, Chester? Chester stands up. And since these boxes are now broken, can I, like, rummage inside of them? <laughs> um, sure, you find just a collection of apples and a few silver pieces. <gasps> How many? Uh, like, 11 silver. Oh, awesome, that means I have 39 silver now! You just uh, stole from the man. <laughs> and? He's racist. <laughs> it's true. You don't know that. <laughs> you don't know that. Uh, I'm gonna hopefully not roll a 5 again and throw my cards at the back. Oh, right. yo! That's a 3, which deals full damage. And... I put out the fire. <laughs> it'll do 7. Yeah, let's go. The good thing about your class is you have an actually really good cantrip. <laughs> Woo! It's a plus 4, so... Alright! Next up is Kid. Okay. okay, I'll I'll move up here and then I'll attack with my rapier. Ooh! <laughs> oh! 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 Um, like the that. the jelly is kind of chopped up into pieces at this point, but you take the last piece and you sort of just like he eats it. You know, a chef chopping a carrot—that's kind of what you do to it. As it um, <laughs> squelches and kind of disintegrates into the ground. And combat ends. Nice, that definitely a little, little, that was a little bit more than a rat problem. God. It's a bit of a health uh, issue, if you ask me. Earl kind of goes over to Raymar uh, and then gives him four more of the good berries because he made ten. I'm going to cough my lungs out. <laughs> uh, and then Earl's going to give the final five to Chester. All right, uh, you guys. So Chester five, Raymar four. Okay. Chester only needs four more HP though. Oh. Okay, then five to Raymar, four to Chester. <laughs> there we go. Perfect. Man, uh, Raymar, these you, are you'd some at, good berries. You'd be at six, by the way. Wow. You changed yourself yeah. to five, but... Alright! Ugh. So, he will sort of come up and be like, Oh, uh, uh, apologies, um... I didn't realize it would be such an issue, um... I thought, I genuinely thought they were rats. I didn't know a big slime was living in here. Man, I almost died. I swear if I don't get that wizard hat, I'm gonna be so mad. 
Fine, fine. You guys can take one from my selection, and you guys yeah! can... And you guys can take one from the store. Yeah, get him off the map now, yeah. Call dibs. Okay. From what he said, do we all get one? Or is it, it it's, two total? It's two for the party. One you can pick out of the shelves here. And when you guys are ready for okay. the other, he will lay out some options ahead of you. I'm putting okay, this I, I, feel, I feel like Chester deserves the hat. <laughs> Unless there's any other opposition to that. I mean, right. we don't know what most of the other stuff does, right? No, you don't know what well, any we of should ask what the, We should ask what the hat does before we yeah. buy it. I don't care, I want it! <laughs> hey, what does, what does this hat do? My friend here definitely seems interested in it. So the hat will increase your intelligence to 19. <laughs> Is that in character? <laughs> <laughs> you played him like a fiddle. It literally only increases my intelligence by one. <laughs> just, I just That's imagine so he like cool. reads it off like he would in a, in a newspaper. <laughs> No, no, what, what he it doesn't tell what? you is that it increases your charisma because you look so cool. <laughs> well, what he really says is, oh, that's a hatch that um, has the power to make the user smarter. I'm, I still want it. <laughs> yeah. I still want it. Chester, I that, that'll be the, that'll be the option. option for the store. Okay. Now, I'm guessing it's time to look at this, uh, your selection. He's just yes, um, longingly. Here. <laughs> yes. And he will lay out some items. I'll oh, leave you there, buddy. Boy. All right. The first item you will see is a small pink pearlescent orb growing a faint light. Very similar looking to the uh, pearl you have, uh, Earl. Mm. A wide, thick leather belt with a beautiful iron buckle in the shape of a mountain. Mm. A medium sized blue cloak. That is extremely light. Mm. A small golden ring with an eye constructed of jade embedded in it. And a small blue burlap sack tied by string. Oh. Mm. Mm. I'm guessing we may ask what these are, Mason? Um, <laughs> nope. Unfortunately, I don't know what these do myself. I couldn't identify them. Mm. But they're each worth about a thousand gold pieces if you just wish to sell them. Ah. Mm. Can I do an arcana check on the orb? Yeah, each of you can make an arcana check on an item of choice. I want to make an arcana check on the cloak. Alright, uh, please make an arcana check, the two of you. Yep. God, my I have a so plus good. one. I have a plus one. Mm. All right. No you are unable to identify the cloak, but kid, the pearl seems to be a <laughs> pearl of power. Genius. Um, which is an extremely rare magical item that uh, not extremely rare, but a rare magical item that can restore a spell slot when used. Mm. Up to level three. Ooh. Kid, while I'm staring uh, at this hat, can you get? Can you take something that you think I'd like? I'll leave it entirely up to you. Also, uh, Ray, I assume you want it. Yeah. <laughs> uh, you're not gonna like, give it to someone else. No. Okay. So I'm going okay. to put it in your inventory. Just Photoshop it um, poorly onto your the rat head. <laughs> Um, I will say I am interested in this cloak. It's, in my opinion, rather fashionable. I, can I arcana check it for you? Uh, sure. Hey. Uh, did you uh intel or did you arcana and check the cloak? Yeah. All right. Um, you will find that it is a cloak of protection. A uh, medium-sized cloak <laughs> that, when worn, will give a plus one bonus to armor class. I wonder who needs that. A lot of mm. you. Yeah. yeah. 
Um. No one here has an AC of over 16. <laughs> I have a 14. I have 12. I'm just gay. <laughs> <laughs> that is your armor class. Gay, is a gay armor class. You hit me, you're homophobic. Uh, that, mm. That's a plus one. Plus so, one homosexuality. You hit me, you get gay. Bro. So, are we going to vote on who chooses which magic item, or just how are you deciding who gets also, this? Also, Chester, you still it? have um, an Arcana check you could make. Yeah, there's no, the uh, ring. He's busy. He's the busy. ring, I'm the busy. belt. Sorry, I was just checking Chest. something. Um, quite a fan of the belt. The belt. There you go. Mm. I did want to see what the belt was. Our all our kind of checks and checks are spent, so Chester's only way we'll find out what that does I'm is busy. to get it. And there's also the Ring of Jade. Yeah. Mm. So how are you deciding who gets what and all that fun stuff? Mm. Well, you get one item. Yes. See who suits it best. You survive the attack all that you choose. Wait, who are you referring to? You. Uh, kid, any objections? And I'm fine with it. It's quite fashionable. Mm. Alright, Earl, which do you choose, my friend? I'm gonna go pull the wild card move. I'm getting the belt. <laughs> yeah! Alright. <laughs> <All right. laughs> Hype choice. It is a hype choice. Are you keeping it for yourself, or are you giving it to someone? Mm. We're talking group. It's like, like better on me. Uh, I'm gonna do something real quick. What would you like to do? Uh, one D two. That didn't work. You nice. Slash roll. <laughs> whoa. Oh, slash roll. <laughs> slash R. Whoa, Earl, What did you just D say? <laughs> Moment. You privately okay. rolled what you get. Uh, I got a two, which means... <laughs> That's racist, man. That's racist, <laughs> man. Come on, man. But, uh, that means kid gets it. All right. Kid. Sick. I'm jacked. All right. Um, so like, are you oh, just going to put on the belt or? Yeah, I like, since my head is just so humongous and gigantic, I wear it like a choker. <laughs> <laughs> the shark with the choker, what will he do? <laughs> I saw that, right? Um, so you, you, you attune yourself to it? Yes. Alright, um, keep in mind both of the items you've acquired um, eat up an attunement slot. There we go. Uh, do, do you want me to change it? Yes. Okay. <laughs> Who do you think I am? <laughs> Is it like metagaming if I just send the item description to everyone just so they can see it? Uh, I can guess I mean, what it kind of is. It's fine. Now that you already own it, you could literally just oh, make, okay, cool. you could just examine it until you like figure out what it does. So, I I kind of know what it is already, just because I'm a huge nerd. But then okay, again, it could just it, be then? something what else. Is it? I don't. Yeah, what is it? I'm, I'm guessing it's one of the. I forget what it's actually called, but I'm pretty sure like. <laughs> I forget the name, but it increases like strength or constitution. Some type of build. Nerd. Nerd. I am a nerd. Loser. Anyways. Right. Bill. Yeah, no, it's just a plus two con and then persuasion swex on dwarves have advantage. You get a game! <laughs> yeah. Well, what does that mean for a shark? Shark beard? 
Fucking I'm very good at talking to tiny people. Uh, yeah, and then poison advantage, dark vision, and I can peak dwarvish. Peak dwarf. Yeah. Sick. That's nice. All right, I that added all your new stuff to your base character, so you don't forget about it. You now have 10 HP. All that good stuff. Um, trying to remember what I was gonna do, but I remember now. Alright. Uno momento, gang. Sick. Earl is just walking circles around me. Alright, guys. Everybody take a nice, good look at the new Chester Cheddar. Yeah! Yo! Let's get Yo. What you Let's go! Let's go! Sick new hat. So <laughs> So, All right, let's not put a choker on the shark. No, he's just, he's <laughs> hes not powerful. He's so smart. <laughs> His brain expanded one He's fold. quite the clever guy. Do I add the intelligence, Andrew, or, like, what do I do with that? Well, I mean, you gain nothing by doing so. Over because I want you to know, if you, like, ASI your score up, it just, like, doesn't help you. Like, oh, it just okay. becomes a 19. Oh, nice. And, and if if you make your thing a 20, you won't gain anything. It'll just be a 20. So, like, yeah. What do you guys think of my cool new hat? Pretty it cool. is very fashionable, I must say. Thank you. I must. <laughs> Alright. And after this, everybody levels to level 2. Woo. Oh, I can turn into a hat. Let me send over uh, the level 2 Earl. You have your new fancy subclass stuff, right? Yeah. Mine, mine should be um, in my dice cloud. Did you chose chose your uh, subclass, right? Uh, no, because I remember when we were playing, you're like, "All right, Ray, you need," and then you got distracted and moved on to the next person. No, I said <laughs> you need to. I remember very vividly telling you you need to choose your subclass also. Okay. And I said I'll it like it. twice, but yeah. I think you said it after we finished, now that I think about it. Actually. How do I? Uh, my health is doubled. Yeah. Every, I now have. Everybody's 20, health doubled. 20 health now. What yeah, the fuck? Isn't that dope? Can you guys stop putting stuff in chat? It's like. It changes the stream chip. Roll for Pogchip. Roll for Pogchip. Hey yo. Roll for my, Pogchip. My fucking internet browser just crashed. <laughs> Man, your Moment. computer's really good, right? <laughs> I don't know what's... I don't know what's wrong. It's normally... I'm getting it flashback. Like, it doesn't shit itself. He actually crashed from out of brain shock from his knowledge that he just got. <laughs> He fainted. Yeah, no, my computer just couldn't <laughs> render the amount of intelligence that Chester His had. brain is a computer. Hey, uh, Ray's gonna take time on his stuff, probably, and also, it's just gonna be difficult, because it's a new class, but hey. It's a new ass? So I think we all did a pretty good job down there in the basement. I disagree. To this? Oh Jesus, why is this opening in the wrong thing? Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Wee what woo? Well. We could have woo. not been wee knocked woo. first. Alright. Wee woo. Wee woo. Should I have used my better judgment and not. Earl, Earl is sitting on the couch. My rope things. Yeah. Earl be sitting on the couch. I really want to know why there's a skull here. I'm really interested in the skull. Not skull, a brain, I mean. But, oh, yeah, All that's right. his brain. Don't um, worry about it. Well, I'm getting a call. Give me a second. Imagine. Is she a monkey brain? <laughs> it, f it completes the, uh, the monkey skull. Once you complete the two, you get a real, a real life monkey. That would be a bit weird, though, considering skinwalkers, and then there's monkeys, which are basically like 
a sidestep away, in a way. Do we even have a leader in this group at all, or is it just anarchy? No, we're just a collective unit. Yeah. Collective stupid. That's how, like, all parties are, man. Collective stupid. Well, someone's got a hat and, we, and the other us don't, so I think the hat guy is the leader. That's how one piece is. <laughs> I don't they wear the hat, they are the leader. My turn with thinking cat mom. Balm of the summer court. Yes. I have more healing abilities now. More is in like your first, basically. Yes. Wow. Other than the best spell, Goodberry. Goodberry is a very good spell. Yeah, it's a free 10 health whenever you're out of combat, basically. Yeah, true. In combat, it's probably the worst healing spell. True. Alright, um, what else do you gain besides that ability? Man, I'm so glad Chester's gay. Wild shape! Yeah, but that, that auto-adds, um... <laughs> that makes him smarter. And you um, take charm person? And in charm person. And healing word, sorry. Yeah. Charm yeah. person? You said I'm a man. That's the... <laughs> Oh, do you get rid of Wild Cunning also? Yeah, I got rid of Wild Cunning. Okay. I'm just going to unprepare it because you are a preparation caster. I that believe. is very true. Yes, um, it's preparation. Yeah. So I now got Charm Persian, Entangle, Goodberry, and Healing Word. That Healing Word is going to be very good. Because it is oh, a bonus action healing. Oh my god, I can... Use the combination of Balm of the Summer Court as... Oh, no, they're both bonus actions. Never mind. Yeah, uh, Balm of the Summer Court, I can heal someone for a D6... Uh, wait, no, wait, 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 wait. Right, healing word. And then yeah. that should be it, just your new spells and your ability. I, I can heal for someone for a D6... And they get one temporary HP along with it. And then I also have Healing Word, which is a D4 plus spellcasting ability mod. Which for me is 2, so that's a 1D4 plus 2. Then Entangle's pretty sick. Then Charm Person's Charm Person. A classic, truly. <laughs> Anyways, uh, imagine not sitting on the couch, though. New feature. New feature. You gotta sit with the bestie. <laughs> yeah. What the fuck? It's February? Yeah. Yeah. The first. Damn. My birthday's a month from now. Let's go. Yeah. Wait, your birthday's March 1st? It is. That kind is a month days. from now. You know what else happens on March 1st? Uh, what? Uh, funny expansion DLC for a good game. I've been waiting for it for ages. Well, I've been waiting for my birthday since my last birthday, so I think mine's yeah, my yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, fair enough, fair enough. Uh, in advance, happy birthday. Thank you. You have to earn my happy birthday. I'm surprised I haven't already. Nope. Yeah, I can't believe it. You, you, there's still more you can do. <laughs> Pay me money and I'll wish you happy birthday. <laughs> So, what's everybody's hit point maximum now? I should have 17. It says 20 for some reason, but I think I have 17. Oh, no, because you I can take a hit now. Point. Well, I added the constitution. Mine's like Thanks. five. What the fuck? I'm kidding. All right, hey, I'm back. Uh, <laughs> Justin, did you choose Raymar's level 2 stuff that he needs yet? Or 
Vortex Warp. I picked Vortex Warp the other uh, last week. Vortex Funny Warp spell. infusion or spell? Yeah. Okay. Did the you pick your two. infusions? Uh, the armor one, I think. You get two. That's specialist. That's specialist at third level. Shit. Wait, no, wait, no, 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 no. Uh, I'm thinking. Artifice to heavy infusions. Uh, there's a few armor ones. Uh, armor of magical strength. Uh, enhanced defense. Okay. And then rogues don't get anything crazy at level two, do they? No, just it's their... just cunning action. Yeah, which is very good. Don't get me wrong. Oh yeah, no disengage is crazy. Yeah. And dash. Uh, that's 90 feet of movement per turn if you use yeah, all of your actions. I'm, and if I'm going to be a funny swashbuckler because I'm a pirate man. Face. <laughs> oh yeah, swashbucklers get the ability to uh, drink potions as a bonus action too, right? Oh really? I didn't know. Pretty sure. That's yeah, I believe back. that's them. I might be soul knife though. I still don't know. Oh yeah, you'd be the second soul knife rogue. Soul knife is sick though. Bold picker. Oh, I'm good. Oh boy, as a second, literally, oh my god, you can make the best item in the game as an artificer, let's go. Uh, Enhance defense? Alchemy chug. Question mark? Alchemy chug. Oh. Mayonnaise. Mayonnaise. Right, and, and, and what's the new spell you chose? I chose Vortex Warp. Oh my god, a high-level yeah. artificer can make some wild items. Yeah. Dimensional what... shackles, excuse me? And that's why I'm a scam. <laughs> oh yeah, dimensional um, shackles are cool. Arcane propulsion arm. Is our session over? No. We're just okay, leveling cool. up. I'm just yeah, that's sure. wild as stuff. As long as you guys don't have anywhere to go. I do not. I think, like... My computer's on fire at the moment, and I have a clue why. Maybe you should be better. This is just our first few steps of taking over the world. Hey, uh, Justin, you don't get second level spells until okay. level five. That's stupid as fuck, to be honest. Yeah, because uh, artificers aren't full casters. They're actually their own spell progression. Yeah, they're so, half casters, imagine. No, they're not well, even half casters. They have their own progression. They're, they're quarter casters. <laughs> I'm gonna heal level one spell so I get them. Um, you can choose t uh, another one to have. I have a gun. Actually, hold on. I think you messed up something when creating your character. Oh, blah, blah, blah. What'd you say? I think you messed up something, uh, with your character. Intelligence mod plus half your level. So yeah, you did. You should have four spells right now. And you only have one. My god. Five magic items at once at 14th level? Jesus Christ. So yeah, pick three other first level spells, my friend. Okay. Uh, and then, have you made any progress there, Chester boy? Make sure Chester. you get that plus one knowledge. Chester? Then, uh, Chester! Chester! He died. Chester! He left the game, which is a bit concerning. Chester! Chester. Probably his computer again. Moment. Yeah. Well, I'm glad to finally find out what one of the things I have do. I just gotta figure out one last one. Why does my Google Drive say I'm offline? Is mm, Google Drive internet now? Be Possibly. Should I run Gloomstalker Rogue? Gloomstalker? Is that a Gloomstalker Rogue? Stalker? Rogue, yeah. Huh. Interesting. We just get a bunch of advantage. That's all it is. Uh, That's Gloomstalker like is not... No, Gloomstalker is Ranger. And yeah. Where can I find subclasses? 
Um, it is uh, multi class. Oh, it's, multi class. Um, remember, it's under play styles. Beholder's Paranoia, Demon's Inferno, Devil's Gambit, Lich's oh, Tomb. I'm looking. The hat unlocks your sacred abilities. Your brain has expanded. <laughs> Yeah, I think I'll put Cure of Wounds on this man. Um, Justin, I just want to say, I have pretty good healing ability now. I don't think you're going to have to worry as much. Like, you see, I need to do my funny scam sometime. It's like, I, mean, I don't know if it's going to work or not. i got to cut myself and heal myself. Okay, it works. Stab myself Mate. right in the thigh. <laughs> Shank yourself. Well, let's go. The Earl stab me right, right in the leg. Scare the hell out of the the guy. Like, don't worry, it's fine. I'll use my snake oil to heal myself. Man, Hardmaster has some cool ass. Subclasses. Just throwing that out there. Thank you. Yeah, the Thank one you. I played, I only got to like first level, but I was looking at the subclasses, dude. Oh, this is an updated card master too at this time. Oh, it is. Yeah, the one you played had. Like, I played the barb one, right? Yeah, you you also in that campaign you got to like level three. I'm like level three. Yeah. <laughs> but um. Yeah, it, it, it used to be, like, just, like, basically, like, bard, sorcerer, wizard, cleric knockoff. Now it's, like, fully unique and interesting things. Oh, shit, that's cool. Yeah, like, there's a one where you... It, the one is basically, like, Hexblade, except a little different. Like, you summon a weapon made of fire. Ooh. Um, another, uh, you can uh, re-roll your attack or an enemy's attack um, and take the new roll, but... Sorry, uh, but the next time you roll a crit, you won't make do any extra damage. Um, it's like, uh, what's the divination wizard? That's what I'm thinking of. Divination wizard? It's kind of like that. Uh, I don't know shit about wizard subclasses. They're so hard to differentiate in my mind. Also, no one I've ever run for has played a wizard. Um, I, don't I, don't really I don't like wizards. I just like divination because I play it for... I do rogue subclasses with it because it just lets you roll dice at the beginning of a long rest and then you just like get to replace dice with them. Chad Lucky Perk. Or Pete. Yeah, that's kind of like what Divination does. Uh, bing bong. Uh, then there's another where, um, so. Uh, as a card master, like, you use a card and then you can't use that spell again. Um, uh, as, um, the, uh, uh, the Lich's Tomb one, you can put the card in a tomb and basically, like, in a metaphorical tomb and you get to use it again. What does the Devil's ga Gambit one do? Is that what that was? Um, the Devil's Gambit one is basically, like, Let's say you miss an attack, you can re-roll it and use that roll. Uh, but the next time you crit, uh, it'll only deal one dice worth of damage. Holy shit, I'm I'm getting this. Huh. What are you getting? False life. Full swing yourself with a necromatic max meal of life. You gain 1d4 plus 4 temporary hit points for the duration. This is one hour. Moment. That's awesome. I never actually looked at the artifice or spell list. Pretty cool. Is all I pick Yo, a Grease. What's up? Is all I pick a subclass? Uh, yeah, and then you can change up your spell list if you want. Yeah. Where do I find the subclasses again? I lost. It. Uh, it's. It's under play styles. Okay. 
Sorry, I just had to remember. It's okay. Guns locked to artificers. Oh, um, anyone get a gun? They're locked to artificers in the gunslinger fighter subclass. Fuck. Yeah, I wanted to. I wanted a gun. I get to keep my gun. I want the gun. You want I gun want a gun. A gunslinger. What if we all just have guns? Yeah, we yeah. just have we just the have desperados. Shoot. The desperado. The wild west. <laughs> yeah, you guys actually like subclass your next three levels into fighters, so you can. Gun proficiency. Gun yeah. proficiency, let's go. Yeah, and then we use that to fucking, like, colonize. <laughs> Just like real life. Just like yeah. real life. Yeah, firearms are pretty new. So, like, Raymar and the captain are probably, like, surprisingly enough that they would be in the same place, but only, like, the probably the first two people either of you guys have seen with a gun. It's pretty fucking cool. He had a, like, he had a big old, he had a, you know, like, yeah, like. I wish I had a big iron. Yeah. That would have been awesome. You had the choice. Look, there is a subclass where theoretically you could re-flavor as a big iron. Who do I need Man. stuff from? Uh, have you chosen spells yet, Justin? Uh, all slave detect magic and look at another one. I think I'll go catapult. Alright, those are super easy. False life, detect magic, and catapult? Yup. Uh, I could have sworn catapult is a player's handbook spell. Oh nope, it's Xanathar's. Interesting. I just looked at the D uh wiki dot. Oh yeah, I know. Um it's just because uh this like program has preset spells and stuff, but it's only stuff from the player's handbook. Moment. I see. So if it's something from player's handbook, I can just drag and drop it. If it's something from Xanathar's, for example, I can't. And there's no way to like buy them officially so that they get added. Sadly, otherwise uh -huh. I would have by now. Yep, those are my four level ones. I guess I'll remove Vortex Warp for now. They cannot use it. Instantaneous range is defeat. <laughs> Spell attack. There you go, you got your spells, um... Yeehaw! Mr. Chester. You're gonna, have to, you're gonna have to give me a moment, because my computer finally shit itself. I see. Yes. Moment. Understood. Yes, unless you'd like to read out everything to me again. Um... Okay, do you just want to know the level 2 abilities? So uh, sure. So you know what's going on right now, at least? Yeah. Alright, um, 
Beholder's Paranoia. Um, uh, when you, at second level, you become more alert to danger and quicker to respond to it. You add your intelligence modifier to initiative rolls. When you roll initiative, you can use your reaction to cast a spell card in your hand with a casting time of one action or one bonus action that only targets and affects you. Once you do so, you can't do so again until you complete a long rest. So basically, you can use... Excuse me. You can use a self spell as a reaction to combat beginning. Like false life or like mage armor or anything like that. Okay. False um, life. As soon as combat starts, you die. <laughs> de demonic champion. When you choose this playstyle at second level, you gain proficiency with medium armor and shields. Additionally, you can use your action to conjure a weapon uh, made from Hellfire. You are proficient with this weapon, and it has the properties of any simple or martial we what melee weapon, except That's it deals fire awesome. damage. That is so cool. The weapon remains until you stop holding it, conjure a different weapon, or die. That is tight. fucking awesome. All right. Gift of the Nine Hells. When you choose this playstyle at second level, you learn how to use a volatile energy harnessed from the Nine Hells. As a bonus action on your turn, you fill yourself with this energy. Your next spell attack before the end of your turn is made at advantage. If you miss the attack, its energy backfires onto you. Make the spell attack again, exactly as before, except this time targeting yourself. If the attack hits you and deals damage, its damage cannot be reduced in any way. I, that is also really fucking cool. Um, but... In... Oh, wait, there's two abilities at second level for these two or for all of these oh wait no okay go back to the demonic champion one the one with the flyer weapon sir i i'm not looking at it no no i'm just saying like mentally go back to the oh fire yeah, one I am, I am i am thinking about it yes all right um also at second level your spell cards do not disappear when cast but instead burn into magical flames that move at your will whenever you cast a spell card a number of wisps of flame equal to one plus half the spell's level begin to circle around you. These wisps last up to one minute, and you can have a number of them conjured at once equal to your uh, intelligence mod modifier plus half your card master level. Whenever a creature within five feet of you makes an attack against you, one of these wisps launches at them after the attack is made, hit or miss. The attacker takes 1d4 fire damage, and the wisp disappears. That's fucking cool. I, I, I want that one. Oh, uh, you just straight up want that one? Uh, how oh, I'm thinking. Do you want me to? I mean, that's kind of sick. Finish reading the final two. Um, sure, yeah. All right. Do you remember the one with the backfire one? Yes. All right. Um. Also, at second level, you can call upon the devil's luck to aid you. When you miss an attack or are hit by an attack, you can use this feature to reroll that attack and take a new roll. Once you use this feature, your future luck becomes tainted. You derive no damage bonus from your next critical hit against a hostile creature. You can't use this feature again until you would have scored one. Mm -hmm. Oh, you get it after you get a critical hit. I see what it means. And then uh, finally, Lich's Tomb. When you choose this playstyle at level 2, your card magic is imbued with necrotic energy. Whenever you cast a spell card, rather than discarding it, it is considered to be in your tomb. And it remains there for up to one minute. While a spell card is in your tomb, you can still use it to cast spells as if it were in your hand, but you cannot use it for features that call for discarding a spell card. When you cast a card from within your tomb, it is discarded and therefore no longer in your tomb. Additionally, at the start of each of your turns, you gain temp HP equal to half the combined spell level of all the spell cards within your tomb. If you cast a spell level at higher level, or a spell card at higher level, it is considered to be of the spell level that you cast it. Man's is just playing magic. Yep. He's at a whole graveyard. The that that last one and the fucking fire one is so cool. Uh, yeah, uh, honestly, those are like the two ones that I would consider if I was playing. So, how good is Chester with like melee weapons? Though, um, not very. Yeah, that's what I. Your was strength thinking. is the lowest it can possibly be in my games. I see. Which is how, how low is that? Moment. He's he pales. In comparison 
to Earl's 11 strength. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but can I dual wield? Um, that requires fighting style. Can I dual wield? <laughs> no. Justin, you can dual wield whenever you hit a level where you can increase your stats because, you know, feats, they exist. There's a dual wielder feat. Feet. F E A T. So, um, which are you looking at right now? I'm thinking of the 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 tomb one because Chester is not very good. He's not very strong. Uh, you also get necromancy in the future, like um, at sixth level. You can expend your cards to cast Animate Dead. If you can want raise to. weed. Um, yeah. Also, at 10th level, you get resistance to necrotic damage. That's pretty tasty. And um, then at 14th level, uh, you can uh, cast Create Undead as a 6th level spell. I'm going to go with that one just because I, I want to focus mostly on magic. All right. And I like the idea of one day going back to wherever my father is buried and reanimating him. I like the idea of Chester being a necromancer. Just purely. Yeah. That makes it scares me. Laugh. <laughs> and necromancy isn't specifically illegal anywhere in this universe right now. So. Look at him go. Now. Neither is smoking weed, apparently. Well, in, in some areas, yes. But in oh. this area, nope. no. Okay. Well, yeah, I'll go with the tomb one then. While my uh, computer uh, reluctantly loads. Oh, is it doing the same thing it did the other day? No, it, I, it, I just had to restart it. Because it wasn't, like, opening anything. Without it crashing, so. Or the, like, browser crashing. Alright, Power of the Grave is something you're gonna have to remember. Ray, because I'm not going to be able to, quite simply. Bing, 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 bong. Bong, bing, bing, bong. Gosh darn, man. I, I gave it a little skill symbol. Um, Tasty. Kid, why did you just like spam the new feature? I did. You spammed something. It's called new. Oh feature. yeah, I was, I was editing the uh, cunning action. I guess it just spammed it for some reason. Okay. Yeah, that. Uh, so yeah, Power of the Crave. That's cool. Um, and did you want to change up your spell list at all? Or No. Alright. Too much work? For, for now, considering that I don't have my computer at the moment yet. Yeah, well, big L. Like uh, well, what was the thing I needed to remember again? <laughs> uh, power of the Grave. Um, whenever you use a spell card, it goes into your tomb. Every turn you have cards in your tomb, um, you'll get half of the spell level in... Wait, hold on. Let me remember exactly. 
uh, temporary hit points equal to half the combined spell level of all the cards that are currently in your tomb, uh, with a minimum of one. So, if you use a spell, you get, um, one temp HP for, like, every turn. Oh, that's, okay. And then you'll get more, like, if you have, like, Let's say, like, when you get third level spells, if you have, like, two third level spells in there, you'll get three each turn. It's just a little bonus. That's then, very useful, considering and, he's a little weak boy. Yeah, and then, um, you can also use the spell card again from your tomb, and then it'll discard it. Oh, okay. So, like it, it kind of doubles your ability to use spells. Okay, that's that, that's extremely useful, then. Yes. I'm happy I picked that. Because I, I understood the tomb part, like, about, like, that the temp health. But I didn't I didn't, I didn't, didn't realize that uh, I could use it twice. Or more than once. Also, do you want me to roll your spells for this long rest again? Uh, yeah. Alright, um, and that is... Burning Hands and Sleep! Wow, I like both Damn. of those. You like both of those? Yes. Two fucking goaded AoE spells. <laughs> We're done with sauce. Chester's gonna bust it down sexual style. Or whatever the fuck. Yeah, that's Bust it down so homosexual hard. style. It is now approaching 9 o'clock. Uh, does everyone have, like, a decent it's amount of time left, or...? Yeah, it's only 7.45 for me, so I have plenty of time. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm good. good. I'm good. As soon as, like, uh, everything loads up, which it is almost done. Alright, because I was thinking, since we were so on time, on time this time, maybe we can go for, like, four hours if everyone's having, like, fun. Yeah, I'm definitely on. having fun. Okay, yeah, I'm good with that. Let's do this. I got money to spend, so let's go to a place where we can actually spend our money and not go into debt. Believe it or freaking not, I'm almost there. Believe it or freaking not, um, we've been going for almost three hours already. <laughs> oh Damn. boy, we out here. So that's the only reason I suggested going for four hours because I'm I'm still energetic and hyped to continue. So I really Same want here. to go to a smoke shop. Yeah, we gotta go get we gotta go get the rat his weed. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So far, you guys have only explored. If you give a rat its weed, I want to smoke um, it. I'm gonna count that as two. I want to see a rat eat edibles, like in real life. Yeah, you guys have only explored a sixth of the content I have prepared this session. So, a sixth? Jesus. A sixth. Yeah. Well, let's let's go through the line. Let's get the rest of that done. <laughs> Though, uh, the main reason for that is because I prepared five different encounters for you guys to go up to level two. Uh, mm. Depending on which shop you went to and which one you decided. <laughs> I just looked up a rat eating an edible because what I said really made me curious. And there's a video that says THC makes rats lazy. And it's these people giving rats THC it's to see what happened. Oh, oh. I want to be a rat. It's me. Okay. I want to be that rat, bro. I want to be that rat, bro. <laughs> for you, baby. Look, I will. Uh, they lit, dude. I'm sorry for cutting you off, but they literally put this thing in like a fucking vacuum chamber and just like gas it with. <laughs> That's <laughs> fucking awful. Oh my god. <laughs> awful. God. At least let them like Sorry. eat it in like THC cheese. Um, I think. Go, go ahead, happened. Jimmy. What shops 
have we seen on our journey to this shop? Like, what types of shop have we seen around? Uh, so, um, to list shops that caught your eye and weren't closed down, um, include the Iron Hammer Forge, the Scroll Cellar Library, Ooh. um, the, uh, Gin and Thomas, um, bar slash inn, and the Ash and Mortar Alchemy Store. What's the smoke okay. shop called? Um, the smoke shop is called Purple Haze. <laughs> Makes sense. Makes sense. Uh, uh, purple Haze, haze bro. Like, that, along with, like, the black sheep from fucking the Silver Pair of Gods. Yeah, I, I didn't prepare for a smoke shop, so I just stole it, you know? Just gotta steal it. <laughs> I, will, I will say, There's after we do go to the smoke fun. shop, we, I, I would like to go to the alchemy place. I think that would be fun. Uh, I'm make, going weed potion. make, make weed potion. Make yeah. weed oh, potion. Oh, wait. Okay, wait. No, they didn't gas it. The vacuum chamber is actually, like, it's, it, it's like, a puzzle type thing. So they press the lights in the correct order. Um, And the as time, like... Okay, so they, they show lights, and the rats have to press the buttons that correspond to light in the right order and as time goes on it gets harder and apparently the rats just kind of stop <laughs> at one point <laughs> yeah no if they get it wrong like THC starts seeping into their like bloodstream <laughs> <laughs> no if they if they get it right they get a little sugar pellet but if they get it wrong they don't do anything <laughs> No, they okay. So they already made them high before they put them in the vacuum chamber. Okay, that's that's good. Yeah, I was I was very mistaken because I didn't know what was happening. I just see them put this rat in a fucking clear container with like can, vents. Can a rat green out? I wonder. I really like. I mean, rats like. I don't know. I know for a fact, bitch made ass hamsters would green out like no matter what. <laughs> oh, <does it>. <laughs> <laughs> One hundred. They have a heart attack if you drop them case. like five inches. So like, <laughs> Fuck it. I don't. The fucking like Chad rats though. I don't think they would. I don't think it's possible. Yeah. Rats are Maybe too powerful. Mice, but rats no. Yeah. Rats. They've been hardened by the New York sewers. I think they can handle uh, that. That's where they just rats drugs. Rats can chew through fucking walls and hold their breath for like six minutes. Just like me through a fur. Here, I'm putting this in the- I'm putting this in fucking general, like, while <laughs> D&D session loads. I- Yeah, by the so, way, how's the computer stuff coming? It's good, it's like, everything's just like loading on that. Like, I right. have it open, it just needs to finish loading. There we go, now we chillin' on the couch. I- I want you to know, the dude making this video has never smoked weed in his life. Like, I can tell by <laughs> looking at him. The other dude was weed before. Watch so I'm gonna take more. I gotta watch it now. Or if they wanted to maybe take a little bit. Easier. Yeah, that guy has never <laughs> smoked. Holy weed. shit! Do you see what I mean by like the echo or the fucking Perhaps vacuum chamber? We found that when you gave THC to these rats, bro, that man was like born out of a sperm bank, bro. He has not seen the light of day. Showed a preference for these more demanding. He was manufactured, not even born. <laughs> this man has not lived. Yeah, honestly, his, I was about to say his teeth are so perfect it scares me. That man and probably yeah. is like a rat inside so of a fucking really like. <laughs> He's in a lot of cost, yeah. <laughs> okay, uh, shall we continue onwards so we can get our rat high? Nah, TH yeah, so makes rat lazy. <laughs> yeah, no, I, I don't really get how this was even a study. Like, yeah. DHC yeah, that, that, makes you lazy. We I, ate I the rat weed, guys. That's our yeah, show. Yeah, we're not game. rats. They make rats lazy. <laughs> if I ever do the Mary Jane, want to know what I want to do? I want to eat cosmic brownies and lay in my bed. That's like, that's like you, my you game wanna, plan. You want to no. eat, eat, eat two sugar pellets every time you press the <laughs> I want to eat two sugar <laughs> pellets after responding to different colored lights. This is what drugs <laughs> does to a motherfucker. You start, put it, you start pressing buttons and doing sugar pellets. It sounds yeah, like a party. <laughs> I, I, I'm gonna drug a bunch of my friends, like, unknowingly to them, and then just start <laughs> feeding them sugar pellets and red buttons. Start showing them, like, red buttons. 
I really, I want to do that. I want to get a group together and get, like, you know, like, those experiments that they have for, like, rats like that or, like, for monkeys where they have to press, like, the right buttons in order. I want to get, like, a group of friends and just get really high and see how we do it. You make a rat man. I, I want to <laughs> yeah. do that, but, like, I want to host Squid Game in my backyard, like, as, like, I want we Squid Game. Bro, it looks like game everyone's game. on fucking acid, yeah. Or games. Imagine like good game. Uh, games. Imagine doing acid and like you don't remember anything and you're like mid trip, <laughs> but you like just kind of like zone in and you're in like the Mr. Beast Squid Game thing. No, oh, Mr. God. Beast Squid Game. Hey, I miss Squid Game in real life. There's squid people in those like stupid pink jumpers. Yeah, you're oh, you're no. the guy in the jumper. He did actually kill someone. They just won't tell you that. Ball so hard, motherfuckers want to find me. Don't look at my bio. I want to look at your bio. I want you to know, every time I like look in this chat, I see your bio and I like think of the song in my head. It's hard. That's my bio. I've never changed it. I really can't believe they just gave rats weed and they're like, all right, we're going to make them be cats <laughs> now. And then they were like, okay, well, they get lazy. Like, what? Okay, how do you like... That's the thing, though. Most science experiments are like that. You just, like, see what, like, really basic dumb things would happen. This yeah, is where like, our tax dollars are going. Yeah. <laughs> well, thank God that's actually in Britain. So, no, it's not where our tax dollars yeah, are Yeah, but going. I, no, I want you to know that the guy starts off, I listened to the whole video. The guy starts off by saying, dumb people say that THC makes you lazy. Today, we're <laughs> going to test it on rats. <laughs> just the intimation. What? Uh, I, I, this man can fucking test it on himself. I don't know what the fuck he, he needs to make. <laughs> you ain't yourself, idiot. <laughs> this man needs to have a good time with his life. But I'm not a rat. <laughs> that man has never had a like decent day before. He lives in pain. Yeah, just like how just. Yeah, no, he does I not have fun. I I want you to know. So it literally starts train? off. It starts off. Um. Some people say that cannabis uh, happens to make the user lazy. Today, we're going to test that scientifically. With rats. Moment. By being a bitch. By being, like, I don't know. This guy, oh my god. Why is he... Why is he... Why is this dude a fucking scientist? Kid dies, yeah, why I'm is he a scientist? Guy. He could, like, be a male model. His face is so perfect for no reason. He could be a porn star. <laughs> he literally <laughs> looks like hotter Johnny Sins. Dude, I swear to God, if Kid I dies, I'm just gonna play this guy as a character. <laughs> I'm just gonna feed rats weed. Please <laughs> Mason Silvera. I mean, you know what? You'll have two rats to feed weed to. <laughs> exactly. Yeah, let, let's test this <laughs> out. Bring you around around to everyone. I guarantee you that dude is like average fucking height too. Like he's on the dot, like five, like ten or something yeah, like that. Yeah, he'll <laughs> give our five nine is average. Yeah, five, five, he is five ten. He has not grown an inch since age thirteen. <laughs> um, <laughs> he brushes his teeth and flosses twice a day. Like <laughs> he combs his he combs and shampoos his eyebrows. Like, uh, his fucking beard, yeah. <laughs> He, like, never, ever wears, like, headphones or anything that might knock his ears out of place. Like, he, sl I, I, he sleeps on his back and hands at his hips every night. <laughs> <laughs> he sleeps like a pencil, bro. <laughs> I guarantee you that man only wears tidy whities Yeah. <laughs> His underwear got no patterns on it. <laughs> He's got like the basic same like five pairs of like white tidy whitey. <laughs> he has his all the same like under armor undergarments, bro. His <laughs> wardrobe is all flannels and jeans. Nothing else. <laughs> he only no that man only wears jeans though. He yeah, only wears jeans and his only wardrobe changes are like t-shirts, flannels. And fucking, but he buttons the flannels all the way up, by the way. And um, <laughs> denim jackets. That's all. We... That man eats kale. Play the game. Uh, we're waiting for Ray. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. Can't believe it in this economy.
We're just making idle chat while his computer. We're, we're talking about weed rats. While weed his rat. computer stops dying. What, did you think we were just holding up the game to talk about this? Just <laughs> roast this guy? It's more important. <laughs> yes. <laughs> we, we, we decided that, like, we were going to halt the game just to spend, like, 20 minutes wailing on how this stupid <laughs> it's, it's so important. It's so important. That that man wears socks that goes up to his knees, I guarantee it. This guy has he a wears life. socks when he goes to bed. This guy has a <laughs> library case at his home he uses to, like, pretend like he reads, but he's only read, like, half of the shelves. Now, yeah, that man... No, 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 no. If you have, like, books in your house and you're, like, not currently enrolled in, like, school or something, no one ever reads. You get those to make yourself look smarter. That's I, why you I, get books. That man doesn't have a car. That man rides the fucking, like, bus. <laughs> he he rides his bike. He rides the metro. <laughs> he rides a scooter. <laughs> <laughs> that, no, that man does have a car. He has, like, a Nissan Versa, bro. <laughs> 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 no, no, no. When he became a scientist, like, he made big money and he used all of that money to buy, like, a Jeep. <laughs> oh, my Jeep. No, he. This this man has, like, a Nissan Altima. He's like, they're very fuel efficient. <laughs> yeah, he lives in Britain. He wouldn't even be able to get a Jeep. He has an electric car. <laughs> <laughs> but it's not a, it's not a Tesla. It's like, the fuck? It's one of like the sparks. Like like yeah, it's you. like a it's like a what the fuck is that brand? Mitsubishi. It's like a Mitsubishi electric car. <laughs> <laughs> it's very cost effective. <laughs> and I'm helping the environment. <laughs> <laughs> what can you say about yourself? He like holds it above you. <laughs> He's no, like, he doesn't you know, seem like that type of guy. Car. Like he internally holds it above you, but he doesn't act like that. He's like too uncomfortable to act like he's better than anyone. <laughs> he's, he's, he drives an electric like... car, and he's like, you know, there was a study we did uh, that, that rats that drive electric cars, like, fucking... <laughs> 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 I like the cars idea that he's like, passive aggressive through rats. <laughs> he you know, my rat not... can get rats high. that drive electric cars tend to make them five times more money. <laughs> he hasn't touched any drink other than, like, <laughs> Water in eight years. No, water that man only drinks juice. bottled water. And when he sees someone go to like a water fountain, he's like, you know, rats that drink from water fountain die earlier. <laughs> <laughs> they find they find five percent more microplastics. Yeah, no. <laughs> when, whenever anyone brings anything up, he brings up some rat study he did. <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> like, no, his friend offers him like a joint, and he's like, this study I did on rats that consume THC. <laughs> I don't like being lazy. <laughs> I'm a very it's productive like, oh, man. I, I'm a productive individual. Um, <laughs> I'm a psychologist. I know what I'm doing. He gets invited <laughs> out to drink and he orders a water. <laughs> that man only. Oh, you can oh, no. I thought you just meant to get some water. Glass of milk before bed. <laughs> <laughs> I get a glass of milk before bed. <laughs> I need my warm glass of milk. You sounded so sad. <laughs> Ray, you just change your PFP to Mason. <laughs> this guy's favorite Marvel superhero is definitely Black Panther. Not because he likes Black Panther, but... <laughs> okay. <laughs> because he, he don't want to call racist. Now, his favorite Marvel hero is probably, like, Deadpool. <laughs> his favorite Marvel hero He's is fucking quirky. Captain America. Nah. <laughs> he doesn't... Well, he's in Britain. Why would he care about Captain America? Captain Britain. He's it's an Captain American Britain. Nationalist in Britain. He's well, a um, he's a Captain Britain fan. That man doesn't own any dogs. He owns a goldfish. No, he, he owns a raccoon. Has, I think he just has rats. <laughs> <laughs> His house is just infested with them. <laughs> he, he like has, talks to them. He has like one snake, so if the rats from his experiments die, he can just feed it to them. Okay. Very cost effective. Ray, please get your PC up. Please, I beg of you. Very, very cost effective. I, I like the oh. idea that he like compares prices of rats. It beats using the incinerator each time. This, al this albino rat. This goes for like five hundred. 
this regular rat. <laughs> with like he he sells rats on the side, like whenever he doesn't eat anymore. <laughs> sells the big rats. You want a rat, kid? He produces rats in his lab. <laughs> he grows them like plants. This is a great D and D character. I heard I heard the word produces rats, and I just thought of something really awful. Say it, fuck it. He's okay. I just thought of him like rest feeding the rat, and then I just <laughs> didn't like it. <laughs> it's like the fucking president from Smiling Friends. <laughs> No, no, like, you know, Toby Spider-Man had the, the wrist, wrist flaps. Like, the rats come out of the wrist, the, his wrists. Oh, God. Just rat sperm. They just spray everywhere. Bro, you just, just, like, that wasn't even related to anything. You just said rat sperm. Yes, I did. <laughs> <laughs> he did. He did. He did. Spider-Man. Rat sperm. I can't wait to make him, like, the final boss. <laughs> it's me, guys. You I beat him by rats. like eating in THC. <laughs> no, just, he literally <laughs> just summons like twenty rats per turn. <laughs> They're all get there. You get there, he's like, oh, the rats are my experiment. <laughs> uh, uh, imagine see, having I, to summon rats. rats you just be a rat. I've you done every. Hero. I've done every experiment I can on rats. I think it's time to move up. Oh no! We're going for rodents. I'm going to become a rat. I'm going on a rat. <laughs> I'm going to become a rat. <laughs> <laughs> That's his final experiment. He's like, let's see if uh, we can change. We can shape shift humans further uh, beyond. <laughs> let's see if the blood god will accept my offer. <laughs> he like slits his wrist. Rat. I am now a rat. <laughs> okay, new D and D boss oh, right God's here. Taking one of his rats and just. <laughs> Completely embraces blood. No, right. I think it was you who said it. I like the idea that the final boss is just me. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's always been like my favorite idea. I really, I, I, I no, wish... I all right, it. right. How long do you think it's gonna take for your computer? It's just fucking Sao. I don't. I honestly don't know because it literally loaded everything and then went on a back screen. So it's 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 taken a, a minute or two or three uh, or five. No, so I'm gonna just like sh uh, stream their screen. So is it gonna feel like happening. last time where it'll take an yeah. hour? It definitely yeah. will take an hour, but yeah, I'm okay with screen sharing the thing. Yeah, just like fighting Andrew is like the end of every JRPG where you just like fight God for no reason. <laughs> <laughs> All right, someone stream it for him, um, so we can continue. Uh. Doi, doi, doi. Or I can just watch your watch your stream. Ah, uh, but delay. No, oh, yeah. Be faster than del the delay. Be faster. Dude, do, 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 do. Just be fast. Up. Thank you, Justin. Yeah. yeah. All right. I'm literally on um, weed right now. Where do you guys head next? The smoke shop. Weed. Weed. All right. Um. I need to run so an experiment. You all <laughs> enter the smoke shop and it ranks like. <laughs> Oh shit! I'm telling, like, the rats can smell that rat. You feel me? Oh. <laughs> shit, nah. Yeah, the rat, the rats can already smell it. Like, what's the range? What's the range of our super smelling abilities? Well, Sixty-seven my, feet. My, mine was sixty-seven. So yeah. Uh, we have an advantage. Earl's is like sixty-eight. Yeah, you like guys, you better. guys have an advantage on perception set checks that rely on smell. So okay, perception check. I'm gonna see how good I smell. I'm gonna uh, see if that person can squirt. Okay. Okay. <laughs> they got it. Hey, dude. Um, Let's go. <laughs> okay. Where is perception? Also, only advantage. the rats have percep uh, advantage on smell. Yeah. Um, yeah. yeah. I got. I got. I got a, it. I got a it good ranks. Way. You can. You can literally can you, like smell. Can I roll a to see how Earl, good Earl coughs. Earl coughs because it's so intense. Yeah. <laughs> um. And, and as you pull up to the counter, um, you see this like. What? What? I'm I'm thinking how to describe him. You see. It's just me, like in real life. You you see a minotaur <laughs> man, um, with long like dreads um <laughs> and he's wearing on his head he has like one of those rasta hats 
Like, <laughs> you, you know the ones I'm talking about, right? <laughs> like, super stereotypical. I think there's a character like that in, like, Zootopia. I don't, I don't know. Yeah. Um, and he's like, hey, what's up, dudes? Holy shit, I know who the fuck you're talking about. Can I, can I roll perception to see how good the best weed in this place is? Alright, yeah, sure. <laughs> like, weed based check. off scent alone. Yeah, can I, can based I roll Based off scent? Oh, uh, yeah, go ahead. Uh, you can usually smell how good it is, so. Guys, I have advantage on weed. Advantage on weed? That's not on weed checks. <laughs> <laughs> Andrew, I need you to do it for me. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Um, it's okay. I remember. Perception. Oh. Oops, oh, sorry. he smells it. Oh, um, yeah. It's oh, wow. Oh, yeah. Okay. okay. The best smell of our whole uh, life. Yeah. So, <laughs> it, 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 it seems definitely like... It definitely seems like there's some, like, sativa, like, perp. Like cross train. Yeah, they, they got the they got the evil wizard bead in here. They do have the evil wizard bead in here. I wanna I wanna walk up to the man at the counter and be like, hey, sir. Ah, <laughs> uh, what's up, dude? Do do you, do you have the do you have the you know the shit that'll make you like play the loop backwards with your tongue? Oh, I got some of that, and then he'll, like, reach under, like, the glass counter where you'll just see, like, giant nuggets of weed, basically, on, like, little pedestals. Um, That's fucking awesome. And he'll, Is that like, the shit I can smell? Yeah. Is, it, is that the shit you consider evil and possibly, like, made by a wizard? <laughs> oh, you want some evil wizard weed, bruh. <laughs> He will like put it, put the like nug he was grabbing back on the pedestal, and like turn around behind him and like open a drawer, and you'll just see him like take out this nugget, and it's like pure black, and the stench <laughs> radiating <laughs> off of it is disgusting. It smells. Maybe we don't do that one. It smells like tar and gasoline. How how much for for like a a good grind of that for the you know wizard I mean? bead? That'll yeah, be, the... that'll be ten gold, bro. D bro, only ten? Yeah, for this whole nug, bro, and it looks like like I'm... five grams. Uh, I'm, uh, I'm, I'm, paying, I'm paying this. <laughs> All right. This the way. Uh, I'll take the money out of your account. You now have a hundred filler gold remaining. You... And we round of applause. Round of applause. In your consumables, <laughs> I will add. Um, <laughs> evil wizard <evil>. veed. <laughs> this is the <laughs> evil wizard veed. Wizard veed, and you have five grams of it. <laughs> God damn. <laughs> we gotta get someone hooked on this shit. Yeah, it's gonna be <laughs> Chester. <laughs> Chester, <laughs> no, I no, can no, smell like that like from here. I. Yeah, Put Chester. Chester ranks now. He's ranked. Chester. <laughs> Ranky <laughs> dang. <laughs> Chester, I think you should find some sort of, uh, some sort of, like, container yeah. for that to seal it in, so, Damn, because my nose is, like, physically hurting. Ass. It smells so uh, bad, did, my Do you want to put hurting. it in your backpack? No, I'm putting it in my pocket. <laughs> okay, you're keeping I'm it in your pocket, out. okay? No, you know what? I'm putting it under my hat. <laughs> I'm casting a right, you know, over my own nose. The, the, the hat kind of, like... Dampens out the smell a bit, and you can only smell it when you like get right next to him. Weed hat. He just kind of <laughs> smells like a rat now, like an uncleaned rat. That sounds kind of racist. All right, and <laughs> and now that you've that bought some uh, clean rat, now that do you've bought a, some evil wizard do bead, uh, <laughs> do I need to buy rolling paper for this too on a grinder, or do I just eat this? Uh, you can you can buy rolling paper here if you want to. Just chew into it. Yes. Can, I, can I just can I just eat this and will it have the same effect? No, that's not how weed works. So, so, I well, mean, hey, it'd be a lot. Chester. Chester's just like crazy at it. All right, dude, <laughs> Chester's dude. just wild. And, and he'll like he'll like say, "I almost forgot, bro." And he'll pick out he'll take out like a piece of parchment. It's some rolling parchment, bro. And he'll hand it to you. You know, you run a fun. Or you run a fine establishment here, and then I tip him fifteen silver and give him a kiss on the on the head. Oh, um, he'll just accept your kiss. He doesn't really understand what's going on, and then um, he will take the silver and he'll be like, "Thanks, bro." <laughs> oh 
Holy shit. Chester, Chester. Um... <laughs> wait, wait, did you just take it out and start smoking it? Like, <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That's my response to him. Oh, did you just start um... coughing? <laughs> no, my response uh, is to start smoking it. Oh, actually? Please. Yes. <laughs> Alright, so you just, like, start rolling it on his counter. <laughs> Alright, now roll for strength. Alright. So, um, just, uh, for how good you, uh, roll it, uh, I'm gonna make a sleight of hand check for you. You got a 12, um, and the joint takes two grams to put together. Awesome. That means I have enough um, for another one. Um, I just want to say, Earl casts Druidcraft and makes, like, a floral scent. <laughs> just so he doesn't have to smell that. And you, you just start so... You just start smoking it as you walk around? <coughs> yeah. All I'm right. gonna have a, a mage hand to cover up my own nose. Just Earl, gonna... you gotta be the most this bitch-made rat I've ever met in my life. I don't know what that means. All right. Yeah. You smell horrible. Have you ever seen? Have you ever seen like an albino <laughs> hamster with like bright red eyes? Have yeah. you ever seen God? That's like what <laughs> Chester's eyes Probably are like right will. now. And um, Chester, you're having that like effect where it's like red and green lines over your vision. Oh fuck yeah! So you're like <laughs> baked, like literally baked. Everything, Dude, everything's like framing and time's moving slow. Yeah. Yeah, like as you turn your head, it's like different frames all patterning across your head, and you don't know where you're looking at any given time. I I'm simulating that. a sight right now. All right, uh, where do you guys head yeah. next? Uh, alchemy shop. I would like to go. All right, to the alchemy store. Da -da -da! Ash and mortar. Full metal alchemist. Yeah. Full I, metal alchemist. I don't know what it is. I'm just a fan of this building. I, I created it and I just like it. it is I just wanted to say that. It does look nice. Thank you. It's I wasn't building. fishing for compliments, but thank you. <laughs> that one stop me. This building is ass. Okay. I think it's so. He, is he smoking in here? Yeah. It's a big joint. Hey, um, no smoking, <laughs> please. Could you step outside? <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm sorry for my friend over there. He might be... One second, one second. Chester, Chester. Yes, chance to move Chester, him. Chester. And Chester, um, can you please step outside real quick? Uh, just step outside until you finish that. Um... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Earl kind of told me to go. Earl, <laughs> do you go? Chester, do you go? Did you go we, outside, we, we Chester? We are forcing him out. We're forcing him outside. Okay, you guys We're just like, push him outside, and he's like yeah, he's, smoking out here. He he is too high to even consider what's going on right <laughs> yeah, now. Yeah, that the laughter right now is in character. Yeah. <laughs> Fucking cackle. Anyways, sorry about that. I know he's. It kind of smells horrible right now. Oh, um, of course. I don't mind. My sense of smell. It's gone. Yeah. Anyways, um, I'm. I. <laughs> sorry. Sorry. <laughs> Anyways, um, kid, can you go check up? Kid, can you go check up on uh Chester? I think. Yeah, I think yeah. I'll, I'll see what's going on. All right, yeah. Chester. Quick question. <laughs> When you're shoved outside, do you just stay there or do you like wander? <laughs> <laughs> All right, we'll get to the adventures of Chester in a second. Um, um I go out with him and then I realize he's not there and I'm just like fucking panicking. <laughs> All right, Earl, um, continue what you were saying. Hello, um, I'm I'm my name is Earl Earl Alderbrand, and I'm I will say I am ah, interested Renee. in learning how to do some type of alchemy so you wish um, to learn how to create potions yes yes that's exactly what i'm looking to ah learn. perfect perfect well um if you'd like to buy an alchemy kit they are five gold pieces and i would charge you hmm, perhaps 10 gold pieces to learn how to create them. sounds like a good deal to me uh, also i think i got the metrics wrong there because I just remembered how much a push. Uh, alchemist supplies. Right. Okay, sorry, it's fifty gold pieces for the alchemist supplies. 
and mm. then it would be a hundred for her training. I forgot a zero. A zero. <laughs> I mean, I know some, don't I? Um, say. Um, you would you not proficient with alchemist tools now? I'm Let's not. See. Um, I will say. What if I were to trade you some sort of potion of my own hmm. for maybe either cheaper or depending on what you think of the potion, maybe even a free alchemy kit? Mm. Show me the you potion. Know, uh, Earl takes out the sparkly little bottle of liquid. Oh, uh, this potion is quite nice. Yes, oh, I actually. don't... I, I don't know exactly what it does. I've I've found it a while ago and never had the courage to drink it. Well, but... um, if you'd like to know, it's a potion of flight. I'll mm. give you 500 gold for it. Mm. Deal. All right. And so you lose the potion of flight, but you now have 559 gold pieces. What the fuck? Rolls <laughs> rich, baby. <laughs> yeah. Um. All right. So oh, I will take you up on this uh, right. alchemy you kit, and also lose less... 150 gold. <laughs> oh boy. Ahaha. <laughs> but hey. Um. So. <laughs> Um, also, just to let it be known, Raymar, if you want to join, she'll offer at half price to train both of you, if you'd be interested. Yeah. And if both of you know how to use alchemy, then you can assist each other and have advantage when making potions. Uh, I mean, yeah. that's pretty good. I'll, I'll Look, if you want me to, I can pay half of the, yeah. your half. Oh, yeah. Let's... So, okay. So who's so paying half... for it? Uh, I'm paying, so half of the lessons, how much is the lessons itself? A hundred? A hundred. So it'd be a, Okay, 50. I'll pay fifty. Uh, so you have I mean, I got... 59 gold now, Earl. That sounds good. I got 50, like, the whole journey so far, anyway. Yeah. 10 from scamming right. that guy and 40 from gambling. Let's do this. Alright, so just to let it be known, this will take four hours. Actually, no, sorry, six hours of time. Um, Sick. And, <laughs> and now it's it's time for Chester's and Kid's journey. No. Okay, so I'm just going to give you the alchemist <clears throat> supplies, Earl, and then give you guys both your proficiency, and then we can we can go on a little journey, shall we? I, the thing I was trying to say earlier, I felt so bad for cutting you off like so many times. <laughs> I was like genuinely laughing so hard. Is <laughs> my, my cough, like my fake cough, came out so fucking like gutturally <laughs> it started making me laugh while I was like doing the fake cough so I started actually coughing <laughs> and then that made me laugh even more <laughs> so it was just really good for the fucking situation for just <laughs> Chester to just be laughing uncontrollably and that made me laugh even more <laughs> that was, yeah that was a great thing there <laughs> I'm glad that happened I, I like how Earl has just become like the pseudo chaperone of the group. All right, so each <laughs> foot uh, here represents thirty feet. Just to let it be known. Um, so kid, you go out and you like sort of walk onto the street to look for Chester, and you see his pointy hat sticking out amongst the crowd of travelers. Oh, uh, whoopsie! <laughs> Hold on. Each square is thirty feet, like I said, and you see his hat poking out amongst the crowd of travelers. And um, a man will approach you dressed in a fine suit, Chester, and go, Ah, why, hello there, my friend. I like the hat. Who's mine? <laughs> it sure is, buddy. Would you like to purchase some of my wares? <gasps> Yo, what do you have? He will, like, sort of reveal his pocket, and you'll see, like, a bunch of, um, like, basically, like, a variety of, like, vials. Vials of different colored liquids. 
Drugs, 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 drugs. Uh, These, my friend, are poisons. Oh, I was going to ask what they tasted like. Like what they taste they were. bitter? I've never no, tried them. Do they have flavors? No. <laughs> I don't like your you raising your voice at me. <laughs> I'm not. This is just how I sound. Why <laughs> you, who <clears throat> do you do you want to try some of this? I'm quite good, my friend. I never smoke on the job. <laughs> oh, what a fucking loser. <laughs> and, then, and then Chester pulls another drag. Just... <coughs> Alright, kid, you're free <laughs> to like. throughout the fucking city. <laughs> this is beautiful. <laughs> Alright, and um, as this is happening, uh, like the salesman will kind of just like begin, like, sort of trying to walk away, and this guy. Will approach you and say, "Hey, can I get a hit of that?" Whoa, whoa! I spent ten gold on this. You're being aggressive right now. <clears throat> hey, 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 hey! Don't worry about it, friend. I got, what? I got some of my own. I can always smoke that. I just wanted to have a friendly, a friendly talk oh, with my kid. It's not, it's not as good as this shit. I promise. Hmm. I mean, uh, shit. What's your name? Ah, me. My name is Raksha. Rock Shop? Raksha. Okay, Mr. Shop. Um, <laughs> fucking... <clears throat> Why do you look like that? I was born this way. <laughs> I, feel, I feel bad for you. <laughs> oh. <coughs> well, um, do you what need you a lockpick? Or a crowbar? Do you, do you only merchants like go around to walk around here? Is that like a strict thing here? Is like is this the only merchant? Like <laughs> is this the only place where mer uh, merchants are allowed to walk? Most people who live in this city tend to sell things. It's the way of the land around here. That's boring. Nah, call it what you will. I need you to survive. Uh, a lockpick sounds cool, though. What, what can I break into? Anything with a lock on it. Do you lock your home at night? Yes! What, I'll take, I'll take one, then. That'll be 50 gold, my friend. Oh, what the fuck? I think, at least. Did you just say what the fuck? <laughs> yeah, where do you live? So if I do end up investing... Oh, in sorry, this, it's 25 gold. A good return. Why would I tell you where I live? Because I am buying a lockpick from you. <laughs> well, I live in the sewers. Oh, so you tell me you locked the goddamn sewers? No, I lied. Yeah, <laughs> but you're full of shit. Get out of my face. Okay. <laughs> um, kid, you're free to move whenever, by the way. Oh, okay. Yeah. I'm waiting I'm for the next have... person to just walk up to me. <laughs> you're like an NPC. <laughs> <laughs> I sort of like push through the way out of people. Like, I accidentally just like hitting through them. And I just follow the side of his big Dorito hat. Alright. <laughs> and Chester, a big, like, Orcish man sort of bumps into you and goes, Oh, sorry. Uh, you're good. Do you want to hit? Um, he'll like look at like his friends <laughs> next to him and he'll be like, Oh, okay, my friends get one. How many friends do you have? Yeah, just my two boys. So, your boys? Of course. Wait a second. I know you from somewhere. Do you? I think. I don't recognize you. Oh, uh... <laughs> are you a white man? <laughs> you see, like three orcs looking at Chester kind of awkwardly as he sits there and cries. Yeah, I hear him wailing, and I <laughs> run over. <laughs> <laughs> I'm I'm lost. I don't know where my friends are. Chester, Chester. 
Oh shit! Is um uh, one of my friends. Hi kid. What are you doing? Uh, your mom. And then I just run away. <laughs> Chester just starts to run away. Bing bing. No no. Bing bing. <laughs> And he's going, he's going fast, bro. <laughs> <laughs> like, I'm doing the rat run on all fours, you know, like the hop they do. All right. <laughs> you see a building with an appetizing smell. <gasps> I can oh, smell no. it around the corner. Oh, no. Oh, no. Perception check. Oh, no. <laughs> can I roll a perception check to see what kind of cheeses they have in there? Oh, uh, sure. Cheese? Go ahead. I can't. <laughs> I said go ahead. <laughs> All right, thank you. Um, so you smell a variety of different cheeses. You can smell uh, Gouda. You can smell Colby Jack. You oh, can that's smell, my favorite. Uh, Swiss. Provolone. I, I burst in through the doors. All right, kid. Do you follow after him? Uh, yeah, but I'm kind of a bit slow. I'm like almost there. All right, and so you pop in to what seems to be an empty tavern with a turtle standing behind the bar. Everybody, put your fucking hands up. This is a robbery. The turtle will, like, open the one eye he has wide, and he'll, like, slowly <laughs> raise his hands. Now I want you to put all the cheese directly in front of me. I'm not moving a muscle. But my <laughs> hands are raised. You can, you can, you can unraise them. He'll like slowly and, lower them. And get me cheese. The, give me all of it. And as this happens, Kit will open the door behind you. And he okay, will you don't see... have to get cheese. You don't have to get the cheese. Don't tell him that. But I, he I'm... said it's a robbery. No, no, no. He doesn't know what he's talking about. He's out of it. He's, he's yes. Don't not listen normal. to him. What he's do not you normal. mean he's not normal? Can I shoot kid with my crossbow? <laughs> uh, it'll be a disadvantage because you're within five feet of him. That's okay. <laughs> I'm not thinking very straight anyway. I'd be surprised Nor, if it was a disadvantage if I was ten feet from him. Look, oh, my <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. Payback. Look, look. Right. Chester is not thinking very straight and he's also not very straight. Kid, yeah. you feel a sharp pain in your lower back as a crossbow oh, bolt enters you. <laughs> and the same thing will happen to you, Mr. Uh, Turtle Man, if you don't give me the fucking cheese. <laughs> okay. <laughs> He'll, like, start placing the cheese on the counter very slowly. <laughs> I'm, like, on the fucking floor now. <laughs> <laughs> And I just, wait, I go down to a like, kid's level while he's writhing. And I'm like, listen, man, I'm sorry. I just, I'm so hungry. <laughs> if we can buy the cheese, you don't have to steal it. No, but if we buy the cheese, then I won't have as much money. If we we have <laughs> enough money for your cheese. No. Oh, how much, fuck. sir, how much is all the cheese inside of this building? Like, combined. All the cheese in the building is... 50 silver. Wow, okay. Maybe you were right. <laughs> it just didn't have to happen. Uh, well, uh, listen, okay, I'm already too far into this. Now, you're going to help me out with this robbery, okay? And I after he's know, done dude. placing all the sheets on the counter, he'll say, That will be 50 silver. <laughs> 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 this, no, listen here, you fuck, you slimy bitch. Um, this is a robbery. The cheese is not free, though. <laughs> <laughs> the battle of the minds. <laughs> I'm like, I'm like stunned on the floor, like how these two are so stupid. <laughs> I, I, it is now because I'm threatening your life. You are. <laughs> yes, now put your hands up. <laughs> He'll like slowly put his hands up. <laughs> Alright, kid, I'm gonna need I'm gonna need your help here because I'm it's getting to the point of my high work. Um, I, can't, I can't move my legs right. I sort of I sort of limp over and then take the cheese and then like slide him fifty cents without <laughs> like I try to make a slide. I don't know if that has to be slide it. Okay, like, you slide him fifty silver. 
Wait, yeah, I, I slide into the silver and like I try to get uh, Chester not to notice. Thank you for Wait, your purchase. No, 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 no. We're stealing from you. We're stealing from you. Oh. Wait, what? What did he just say? Also, make a sleight of hand to you know hide the pass. Yeah. I'm really surprised no one else has walked in here. It's, like, empty. You don't know why, but, uh, Chester, you notice him sliding the 50 silver to the dude. Uh, kid. Look, I'm, gonna need, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna need go. you to slowly turn around. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> You're not understanding me. We have the key. I need you to slowly <laughs> turn around. I, okay. <laughs> turning. I'm turning. <laughs> you turn around. <laughs> And then yeah, I, 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 I turning just around. Again. <laughs> <laughs> this oh is so God. stupid. <laughs> All right, this time you miss and like hit the counter. And I really says, wish you could hit the guy. <laughs> he says, "No rough pousy." <laughs> <laughs> you fucker! You little shit! I like run up to him and I try to like grapple him. <laughs> All right, you're make a strength three, check, kid. You are a three foot rat. Trying <laughs> how how tall is this kid? I'm like I think I'm like seven foot. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, why are you rolling so good? Uh, he will like it's, push you off him. It's he's a little so bad. He's got the high rage. <laughs> Literally, I'm so, Chester's one of those people where they just function better high. <laughs> This is so stupid, but it's so funny. And then, all right, as I as I like push him, I steal the cheese and run away again. <laughs> no, no, don't run. We're we're in this together. We're we're felons now. So you paid for the cheese. No. Come back. No. <laughs> I'm just, we are, I ran away. All right. Um... So you run away with the cheese, and the turtle will just kind of like let his arms down very slowly, and he will say, <laughs> "Thanks for coming." No problem. No problem. Don't rob me again. <laughs> <laughs> Come again any time. <laughs> All right. So you run away. Hopefully with more <laughs> silver. <laughs> and a. You will get stopped. By another man. Um, it is like a very small ginger gnome uh, wearing overall. Misha. Uh, I, I just gotta say this. It is so funny envisioning Ch uh, uh, Chester just straight up uh, <laughs> blunt in mouth. It's running with an armful of cheese. Yeah, the, the, just blunt, the, the blunt is out by now, for the record. Oh, okay. <laughs> he doesn't no, it's just, like, it's just it, the it, edge of it now. It, it it became a roach when he was in the tavern, <laughs> robbing the dude. <laughs> it just drops out of his mouth. <laughs> and then I'm like, shoot, where'd my fucking blunt go? <laughs> oh no, is he like, going like, to He, he feels like his lips guy. burning. <laughs> oh, what the fuck? Oh, I finished it. <laughs> um, and this like little ginger gnome wearing overalls will come up to you and be like, "Hi there." Well, hey, Connor. How'd you know my name? <laughs> <laughs> um, I don't know. You just reminded me of someone. <laughs> Have you heard of Kanye West? <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 gotta, I gotta go. And then, like, is he smaller than me? Uh, yes. I, like, kick him. I, like, kick his legs out from under. Ow! But I just wanted you to listen to my new song! <laughs> as, as he does this, I, like, run up back to where he was, finally like, catching up with him. And, like, as I pass by, I'm like, oh, hey, Connor. And then I get on my way. <laughs> <laughs> it's Connor, I don't get this joke. Yeah, I don't think Pro does either. She just said it. We, no, we, everyone just collectively knows. <laughs> you don't get the yeah. joke? Uh, yeah, you do. Yeah, All right. Okay. And as you reach this point, um, a man 
in uh, a robe will swing by you and take your hat. Um, to Ooh. which, let's see if you notice. <laughs> you don't notice that this hooded figure takes your hat as you continue running. No. Kid, please. <laughs> kid, 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 kid. I like, I, I'm still trailing behind him. <laughs> Alright, uh, uh, you see me... this hooded figure grasping a red hat in his hands by his side. Oh, you bastard. <laughs> I, like, I, like, try to catch up with him wherever he's going. Alright, oh, he, so... like, here, let me give him a little token. So Big guy! Big guy! <laughs> he's just continuing <laughs> over this way. Big guy alert. Kid, are you like going after me or him. the dude with the hat? Yeah! All right. Um. So you catch up to him. What do you do? I like. Can I like lunge at him and try and like pin him on the ground? Ah, uh, yes. Please make a strength check at advantage because of surprise. Kid, 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 kid. Yeah. All right. Got a fight already. All right. <laughs> yeah. So you tackle him to the ground, and a guard comes over and it's like, "Hey, what's going on here?" He stole my friend's hat, okay? I know this looks bad, okay? He stole the hat. You see this hat? It's special, okay? He and My friend needs this hat. Where is this friend now? Look, he, he's he's long gone, okay? Like, he is... I don't, I, I don't know. He could be literally anywhere. He's like a little rat. I, I've been looking for him. He's, he's such a little fucking bitch. Okay. Make a persuasion <laughs> check? Hat. Make a persuasion check. <laughs> Please, please roll high. I swear to God. All oh, right. Yeah. Um, the guard is like, all right, lad, give him the hat back. And um, thank you, thank you, thank you. He'll like reluctantly give the hat back and get up and just kind of like walk away. Um. <laughs> Can I make a check to see if he like dropped anything? Like that would be of importance. Uh. Roll me a D100. Let's leave it up to fate. <laughs> fate, yeah. fate. Fate, 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 100, 100, 100, 100, 100. Uh, roll D100. Yeah. 11. All right. Um, He doesn't drop anything, unfortunately. All right. I sort of not really knowing where Chester went, like, go this way, expecting him to also be chasing after the guy who stole his hat. All right. Oh, and after four hours of wandering <laughs> the town, Chester, you begin coming down, and you guys meet in the middle around. And can I can I just like pass out? Like <laughs> he's just on the ground in the middle yeah. of the street. <laughs> um. So, uh, kid, as it is now around eight p.m. Uh, you just see across the empty street someone lying on the ground. Cannot identify who it is. Alright. I mean, <laughs> if I can't identify them... I, I... I guess if I can't identify them, I would probably go back into the... the alchemy shop. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, we, we lost them. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, the, the alchemy shop is right there. So, yeah, I go in. All right. This is a white. You like you come back out and I'm gone. Like I like I get kidnapped. <laughs> he's he's nowhere to be found. All right. So um, as you walk in, you'll just hear, and that should conclude our lesson. Uh, thank you. Thank you, Miss. Uh, Very good teacher. I appreciate it. And now I will ask, is there any, like, very weird potion ingredients that you would recommend that here at your establishment? Um, I sell corals, which are hard to find unless you're going into the deep sea. Deep. But, um, hmm. unfortunately, I don't sell any monster parts. Ah. Uh, I bet sometimes that would be hard to come by unless, you know, someone, you know, gets them for you. Yes. But if you want... Perhaps to make your potion of flying again, you would need a Griffith's Wings. 
Ah, that's why it was expensive. Or a Griffith feather, not necessarily the wings themselves. Hmm. Well, thank you for that. Of course. I'll, I'll see if I can come by one of those again. Yes. Well, not again, but still, come by one. What of are those. you doing here? Where's Where's the other? Where's the rat? Yeah. <laughs> where's the rat? That's yeah, where's where's the I, other I rat? Them, I showed him the hat, like just the hat. God <laughs> damn it! No Where'd he go? Look, okay, he's he's <laughs> out of it. I don't know where he is. I I need your guys' help. Oh God, where did he wander off to? I I don't know. I was on like some sort of goose chase. I got his hat back. I thought he would be going after the hat. You know, like he's just come on. I. Uh... Well, come on. We we better find a find him quick. We don't know who he's going to We're just fitting too, don't we? Yeah, we'll probably be smart. They're going around so we can at least try to have a better chance of finding him up. Thank you like all for coming. Thank you. Thank you. I <laughs> like how you guys didn't even say bye. You just say, oh, we gotta find this piece of shit. <laughs> we said bye. Yes, we said thank you. She had to say first. All right. Okay, yeah, oh, we're, no. gonna, we're, we're gonna go and look for the it. long way. <laughs> so, yeah, we're, we're, um, yeah, do you guys gonna... just want to roll a D two to see which way you would go out of the store? Yeah, every every yeah, yeah. crossing is a D two. Every crossing, we gotta see how long this is gonna take. <laughs> <laughs> Here, I'm gonna leave it to a D one hundred. If it's under twenty, it takes two hours. Um, if it's under forty, it takes one hour. If it's under 60, it takes 30 minutes. If it's under 80, it takes 5 minutes. And if it's 100 or other, you just kind of walk to the right and instantaneously find him. Imagine we crit. Alright, you take 30 minutes to find him. As it is now 8.30pm. And you come across him, passed out on the ground. Chester! I... I Earl just kind of shakes him violently. Yeah, just grabs just his shoulders on the ground. Like, <laughs> just shakes him. Can I like <laughs> up? There we go. Wait, what you did? Yeah, uh, wait, wake up, check. Wake up, check. I'm gonna like pick him up and like hold him. <laughs> you hold him by like his cape. Um, what's your yeah. response, Chester? <laughs> um. What time am I? <laughs> what time am I? Um, what realm? <laughs> what realm did I end up? I think you. I think you know. <laughs> <laughs> Just for jokesies. <laughs> um, do I know? I think so. What do you say? Well, I don't. Look. <laughs> <laughs> okay. It's not, I already it's, did it. I already did it. You missed it. Oh, okay. I thought you were gonna like announce it. Um huh? Uh I'm thinking. I just I'm just unresponsive. Chester, are you like conscience? Uh yeah, Earl kind of slaps him a little bit. Oh <laughs> it's always funnier the second time. Alright. <laughs> Chester is dead. <laughs> uh, uh, can't believe it. Um, it could be too strong for him, wouldn't it? <laughs> um, what Earl does is he cra he does the druid craft again, and he makes the scent of cheese waft through the air and <laughs> <laughs> towards Chester. I already had cheese on me. I don't think that would change anything. Yeah, but you and so. It's a stronger it's a cheese set of smell. cheese. Seeing he doesn't respond to the cheese, I just like freak out thinking he's dead. <laughs> <laughs> okay, drastic measures. Uh, what Earl does is he just straight up punches him in the stomach. Okay. <laughs> All right. With his and... tiny rat hands. Uh, that'll deal one damage. <laughs> Uh, do you wake up from the punch? <laughs> Still no. <laughs> God damn. All right, I want to cast a mage hand on him, just to, like pick him up and drop him. Uh, no. He is he's over five pounds, so that does not work. <laughs> God damn. I like cradle him like a baby and like put his little hand on him. 
like he's gone now. <laughs> <laughs> Kid has accepted that Chester's dead. <laughs> I forgot to apologize for killing him. <laughs> wait, wait, wait a second. Uh, di didn't Chester say that he kept his uh, weed under his hat? I have an idea. And uh, would the weed still be in the hat? Uh, no, but you see the weed like firmly like placed atop his head. <laughs> <laughs> Almost as if it's glued there. Um, Earl tries to grab it, but it's just stuck on there somehow. Yeah, it, when you like put your fingers on it, it's like sticky. And when you pull it off, it's like hair on it. It's kind of gross. <laughs> Ah. Uh, and then Earl just kind of holding his own nose so he doesn't smell it, just puts it under uh, uh, Chester's nose. Any response? <laughs> <laughs> in the in the half, well, more like seventy five percent unconsciousness that Chester has, he his first instinct is to put it in his mouth. He open so you see him like wait. open his mouth like a little baby. <laughs> wait, wait. I for a second I thought he was just going to <laughs> bite his hand with the weed. In. <laughs> no, I assume you just um, like open your mouth and start moving it towards it, right? <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> uh Earl kind of pulls away a little bit because he doesn't want him to bite his hand. <laughs> <laughs> He's like a wild animal. <laughs> Once Kid realizes he's alive, he like drops it on the floor. He's like, oh, thank God. <laughs> he begins not to care anymore. He pulls the bowl out of his um, leg. Oh, God, I just spit around. Bolt in, in his leg the, this in the entire unconscious time. unconscious state, after smelling the wizard feed, uh, <laughs> <laughs> I, I just start taking, like, instinctively taking out rolling paper. <laughs> 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 like just I'm unconsciously fully asleep but i'm just getting ready to roll it um do you any of you have anything that will wake parchment. him up wait wait i have an idea and then earl takes out his water skin opens it and just dumps out the entire water skin onto uh chester uh, so uh how does it? I, 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 do you wake up? Uh, that is four pints of liquid. Four <laughs> pints of water. <laughs> Not at first, and then I breathe it in, and then I'm like, ugh. And you just start <laughs> coughing away. <laughs> exactly. Where the fuck am I? Uh, you're currently in Friedman's Gather, dad? and you do not remember what happened. What do you mean? How about that? Um, um, Alright, your high is not over. It is still oh going <laughs> No! <laughs> um, Chester, I'm sorry, but I must confiscate Ooh, your... Uh, what? Uh, is it like, is it is dark it? out? Weed. Is yeah, it's like, not? it's like 9 o'clock by now, like the sun has set. I can't even, like, see them well without, like, focusing. Yeah, no, you just see, like, four or three figures above you. What is the f- where am I? Who are you? Chester, Chester, we got- we gotta hurry, we gotta find a tavern before it gets too late. And then I just start running again. Chester, no! <laughs> and so, you begin running. And you smell a good smell from around this area. Not again, not is again. That, is that the smell of cheese? <laughs> In fact, it is. I burst into wherever the cheese smells. <laughs> no. Not again. All right. <laughs> <laughs> is this so stupid? This is boring. Start off. Hello <laughs> so again. Is it you? This is a robbery. <laughs> no, oh, no. Don't listen no. to the man. No. Don't to listen to the man. <laughs> he is very, very high. Don't worry about him. I um, tried that. I'm not gonna listen. We have nothing to do with him. Don't listen to this. This is a robbery. Earl, I'm, here to, I'm, uh, here, I'm here to steal your heart. He'll like to... Earl, Earl takes a handful of like a handful of his rations and just shoves it into uh <laughs> into uh 
uh, when, Chester's when, mouth. When Chester says, this is a robbery, I'm here for your heart, he blushes a little. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sure. Mm, that's pretty good. It's you guys. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Hello. Um, are, are you, like, are you, you know, conscience? Uh, are, are you, you know, aware or are you still high or I mean, something? I'm assuming the latter. What? I'm I'm definitely I'm definitely so high, but I think I know where I am now. You you guys just kind of like scared me at first. Sorry about that. I don't know what that that is though. Um, Uh, we'll tell you later. (laughs) Oh God! Thank goodness. Do you all want to? Eat or <laughs> drink or I do sleep. think I need a drink yeah, after I would like that. today. I I think I'd wait, like what was sleep. that? What was that last one? Or sleep? Sleep, sleep would also be great. And then then give you day. Chester just collapses on the floor again. It's fifty oh, silver per person a night. Um. I'll, I'll pay. I'll pay my share. Uh, I is... guess. Je- I'll pay Chester's as well. Chester's out of his like little pocket. That is one gold from me. Well, yeah, it would be one gold. <laughs> yes, for my three. Now I have three hundred fifty-eight gold. All right, and I assume you guys just pay. Yeah. Yeah. Earl is just dragging him to the room. <laughs> Would you all like a drink? Uh, very much so. I'll, I'll come back down after I all right, drag um, this guy. So you like, sort of, whoopsie, you like, <laughs> drag him up the stairs, and you see... He, he, he's kind of bumping up the stairs as I drag, drag him up. And you just like set him in the bed. I, don't wait, wait! I tuck him in. I tuck in the homie. Good night. You kiss him on the Earl, forehead. Earl, wait. What? Yes. Can I get a good night kiss? <laughs> uh, fine. Roll for. Roll for, <laughs> roll for a kiss. Text. Roll for roll for kiss. <laughs> roll for kiss. No, you just kiss him on like the cheek. Yeah. Or the mouth wait. if you want to. I'm not kissing him on the mouth. Thank you. Earl does not feel that way you're, about Chester. Earl, you're you're my best friend. Right right after um you're my best friend right after that shark guy. He's pretty cool. Yes, kid. I don't like I don't like that that one that the other one. Raymar? Is that his name? Yes, he he's pretty good once you get to know him. He has his own problems, but he deals with them. Oh, uh, me too. Uh, good night. Good night. I like watching you just like fly across the screen. You <laughs> boy. <laughs> <laughs> well, that was an experience. I gotta imagine just seeing you have his head drop every single step. It's gonna be yeah. good for him. You haven't dealt with that. Yeah, he. Look, a sleeping person is. Surprisingly heavy. At least he was asleep for you. Fair Would enough. you all like my special <laughs> drink? Um, your what special exactly drink? is your special drink? It's the I Gin and Thomas. <laughs> Who's Thomas? That sounds good to me. I'm <laughs> Thomas. <laughs> nice, <laughs> nice to meet you. Whoa, whoa. Wait. <laughs> That's like his name. <laughs> no, wow. it's, it's wait. I wish I, I wish Chester was there so I could ask. What? What? I was gonna, I want to know what that insinuates. What's in that drink? If it's the gin and Thomas. <laughs> um, and he uh, will wait, he will pour um you know a drink and he will hand it to you, and it's in like a whiskey glass. It's about alcoholic. What, what what color is it? What color is it? It's like it? brown. Cool. It's pretty standard. It's brown. It's brown. Um, Errol takes a slightly cautious sip. 
I'm trying it again. Who's <laughs> Thomas? Well, I, 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 I need it. No, I am Thomas. Uh, what'd you ask, kid? Oh, I said I was gonna chug it. Oh, you you were you're all getting a special? Yeah, yeah. yeah. I thought we were all getting one. Okay, yeah. He yeah. hands all of you a special, and you guys are gonna down it. Yeah. Uh, Earl Earl does not down it. He takes a cautionary sip. He all does right. not down it. Raymar, kid, make constitution saving throws. <laughs> oh boy. Alright, fail. No. Kid is so bad at getting Let's drunk, Jack. Raymar? <laughs> Alright, fail. Uh, you guys are both drunk. Um, kid is like wasted. Raymar, you're like more it's drunk than buzz. you normally get. Ray, are you finally here? No. Oh, it says you're in the game. Oh, hi. <laughs> hey, you're Chester, in bed. Chester, Chester. You're in bed. Chester, you <laughs> Come back. Get, you were tucked in. You can no longer get out. You were tucked in. <laughs> you're tucked in with the entangle spell. <laughs> oh, mischief yeah. mouse up to no good again. You, you just hear muffled screaming from upstairs. <laughs> No, no, you just hear, like, the occasional bump from him trying to get out of the bed, but the tuck-in was too too expertly done. <laughs> Tom Thomas, as you guys are drinking, will look at you and go, So, you guys come here often? Not not exactly. I believe this is all, all of our first times here. Yeah, yeah. I've place. seen that one before, and he points to the shark. Mmm. Yeah. So that was a that's a past me. Yeah. I'm a different person now. I see. He'll like take a hit of his pipe very slowly, and like he'll like it'll look like he's sucking in for like a minute, then he'll exhale like a little bit of smoke. <laughs> okay, question: Does it smell like tobacco or does it smell like? It's weed? just tobacco. Okay. We're here on a business trip for wine and stuff. Yes. Moment. Welcome back. Yes, it was actually rather... I, I wouldn't necessarily rather easy. I almost died, and then I almost died again, but... Well, I didn't die. A lot of other people almost died. Well, the, He's two, talking about two, me. And well, the rat. The rat. Yeah. And yeah, also yeah, the, rat the, rat. the other one. He, he is the most common offender out of all of us. I almost died. He almost died twice. Uh... Ray, Raymar over here almost died twice. Kid, I'm pretty sure you're the only one who didn't almost die. Yeah, it's experience. Yep. I think you said rough skinny yours. Maybe. <sighs> Andrew's dead. Can't believe Sorry, what'd you ask me? I said you're dead. <laughs> Did you ask me anything though? No, no. No. You were just, yeah, just saying. Oh, yeah, you were it. just telling him about how you guys almost died, right? Yeah. yeah. That's that. really cool. <laughs> I uh, almost really... died once. How so? I fell down a mm. hole. How deep was this hole? Ten feet. <laughs> mm. fall. A, a rather tricky fall. I broke my back. You're shed? You mm. guys are my first customers. Oh, really? Oh, that's good. I opened oh. shop. And he'll like start counting on like his claws and he'll be like two weeks ago. Oh, oh. I'm proud of you for well, you know. I'll have a drink to that, buddy. And he'll yep. like pour another <laughs> Shin and Thomas and give it to all of you. I Earl like yeah. hasn't even finished his first drink yet. Yeah, he's but, maybe like at most halfway done. But Earl, please give That's me a constitution first. saving throw just to see, you know. How you're taking your yeah, liquor. yeah. Let's see how. Uh, let's see how good this rat is at this stuff. I'm finally here. 
Okay, saving drink. Saving throw? Saving throw? Yeah. Constitution saving throw, normal. All right. You're starting to get kind of sloppy, Earl. You a a, a little bit of a shop. A little bit of a shop. Ray, down Ray, down Raymar, down. you're like, your eyelids are like droopy. Like, you're like, you're kind of like rocking back and forth. And kid, um, if you drink the next gin and Thomas, please make another on saving throw. Did we find yeah. out what's inside of the gym and gin and Thomas? So, <laughs> the Thomas. gym and Thomas. I, actually, fun Tom fact: I was Thomas. originally gonna make it two people running this gym and Thomas, and I was gonna name the drink <laughs> the gym and Thomas. <laughs> but I figured that was like I figured you guys wouldn't get the original pun, so. <laughs> So, Thomas, what exactly is in this drink? All right. Also, kid, you handle it like a champ, and he'll say, "Oh, yeah. nothing much. Just some gin, a cube <laughs> of sugar, <laughs> and some Thomas, <laughs> <laughs> and the scale of a dragon." Oh, oh that is that is. Where do you like... come in? Where's the Thomas coming? <laughs> I made the drink. <laughs> Amazing. It is a how, okay. Question: How does it taste? How does it taste? It's pretty good, actually. Good. It is like very, it, it very... travels down surprisingly easy for uh, Jin and Thomas. A uh, Jin and Thomas. It even. is. It is surprisingly good drink. You are oh, actually a pretty good bud, and I'm surprised you don't have people here. Yes, I graduated. From the Moonshore Academy of Magic. Mm. Hmm. And then I went to bartending school. <laughs> <laughs> I will mm. see your your alcohol is magic. <laughs> I'm gonna pass out. I made the uh, oh. <laughs> oh, yeah, I call this down. Oh, uh, or one one second. I'm gonna get this guy up to his room now. All right. and now Earl drags another person to their rooms and tucks them in. <laughs> who who asked where the Thomas came in? Who was that? <laughs> me. It's me. I, well, no, no. I, I, I asked why. I asked what it was named after. Like, no, but who what said is it? where does the Thomas? <laughs> that, 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 that was Raymar. That was Raymar. <laughs> uh, uh, do you need a Earl, kiss to Raymar? Earl, 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 give me. You, you are as well, but you do not take your liquor that well. Uh, Earl, uh, tucks him in, roll nice. same for you. <laughs> do you kiss him too? Uh, kisses him on the forehead. Uh, good night. Uh, and then... And then from across the room, you hear... <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> Wait, Earl, is. He's Earl. like, he's like transforming. <laughs> I'm just, I'm like, I'm like pulling on the restraints. <laughs> the restraints of the yeah, single blankets of the expertly tucked in. <laughs> the sheets. <laughs> well, it's I'm gonna knock on the wall late. and say, You like that, nerd? Yes, yes, it is. And then he will revert into his shell and just like sit there. Gorgeous. <laughs> Uh, Earl reaches into his coin pouch, uh, and I'm just going to slash R one D twelve. Uh, he kind of brings out a handful of gold coins and puts seven gold coins onto uh, the bar, right, and I then kind of walk. Already, so don't worry about it. Uh, okay. And Earl just kind of slightly stumbles to his room he almost trips on one stair and, and what does kid do i'll uh, yeah. take my way up and wish my old buddy good luck uh -oh. his... old buddy of six hours old buddy of six hours <laughs> why do you keep moving man? okay <laughs> i'm going back up to my room i need sleep we help me out of here <laughs> oh, <I'm Earl. laughs> Earl tucks himself in somehow as much as he did Chester. I sleep on the floor. <laughs> Alright. 
I really, I tried to time saying that as you walked by the room that I was in. And so everybody <laughs> rests up. And that Ooh. is where we will end today. Woo, yeah. That was that great. Was fun. That was fantastic. Yeah, that's how it's coming. <laughs> Earl, Earl the Chaperone. Three man children and a and oh, rat God, chaperone. Yes, <laughs> Earl, Earl's just like one adult but with three child leashes, and they're all pulling in different directions. <laughs> but you here still for the next out. session. I want to. I want him to wake up to this. <laughs> Chester got out of his face. <laughs> <laughs> Just like, hey, want some cheese? <laughs> hey, you want, you want some cheese? He's like, good morning, <laughs> then him winks. I got Gouda. I got. Kobe Jack. <laughs> Good morning, and then wait. Starts listing like thirty different cheeses. <laughs> wait, see, that's right, yeah. man. To unfold. This is this is beautiful. I say I say good morning, and then I like just stand there as you're unable to leave because you don't have legs or arms. I'm sorry. <laughs> you're just a torso and a head. <laughs> <laughs> that, that's all I've left you as. <laughs> God. Oh uh, yeah, I'm very rat. In real nice. The gayer. <laughs> Anyways. Well, I hope everyone enjoyed. Very good. much so. That was that was that was a